everyone. Welcome back. I think we should be good to go. I think I got everything set up. Okay. Hi. Hello. We got stuff to do today. We got big houses to build. <laughs> no pressure, but we have a lot of work to get done today, so. Hey, Venus, thank you for the nine-month reset, by the way. Um, has it already started or not? No, well, Kat, I... Yeah, by the time that you sent that message, I had started, yes, but you probably hadn't seen me yet, which is confusing, so. <laughs> it's because it takes a second for me to go live, so. We're gonna have to do the shell tours, I think, on Monday, Marvel. Um, I was gonna do them yesterday, but then my internet decided to not work, so I couldn't stream. Um, so I think we're gonna have to do them on Monday. I don't want to push this again, though, because I need to get this build finished, so. I think we'll have to tour the shells on Monday. I will, um, post an announcement in Discord about that and stuff, but we've been planning this for a while. I already pushed this from Thursday, <laughs> so the schedule's been a little bit thrown off this week. Um, but anyway, we're gonna try and build the my legacy family from YouTube a new house today. Um, I've got some reference pictures that I'll show you in a sec. We also have to like get all the pictures out of the house and stuff So we've got a few things we need to do. Oh my goodness, Smara, thank you for the 20 gifted subs. What the heck? <laughs> Hello, welcome to the stream. Thank you so 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 much and Daryl, thank you for the 11 months K with the three months Rose with the three months shark with the 11 months. Thank you so much everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my goodness Okay well, while we get started, do you mind if I, uh, just, like, grab all my stuff? <laughs> I'm sitting here and I'm like, I'm gonna need this, I'm gonna need this, I'm gonna need this. I might just go grab all my things quickly so that we've got everything. I don't need most of this stuff, so we should be good, but I want to just make sure we grab all my things as we get started here so we don't forget anything. Look at this. See, I've got all these little items. We just have a whole bunch of things that we must keep and I don't want to forget any of them loads of pictures and stuff so it's gonna take me a sec but I like to do it in front of everybody so you all know for sure that I saved everything picture picture rose I might turn the lights on can't see turn on all lights okay let's make sure we grab it all <laughs> howdy and Zoe and trash and Caitlin and babyface and ghost and Brit and pebs and call me Sarah and Kellen and Sapphire and Nina and doodle and uh, drops and Anne and Katie and Aniso and Sid and everybody thank you for the subs and stuff too okay let me make sure I grab all of these photos bag of money photo baseball bat photo <laughs> future cube fossil honestly expensive TV tragic clown can't forget that Photo, photo, photo. Oh God, fire toilet. <laughs> we can't forget the fire toilet. Oh, photo, photo. We never used that room. Oh, fire ants. Let's get some of this expensive stuff too. Like the kitchen appliances are kind of pricey, so. I might bring those with me. I don't need to bring everything, but like, you know, the computer's kind of expensive. Honestly, these bookshelves I might use again, so I might bring them just because they're kind of expensive. Um, Bed-wise? I mean... I don't know. I just did all the teen bedrooms, like, very recently. It's not for Not So Berry Beanie Nose. This is my YouTube Legacy Challenge, so if you watch uh, my YouTube series, you might have seen these Sims, but... This is the one that I've been playing on YouTube, so don't worry if you haven't seen them. Um, we're just trying to make sure we get all of our necessities. I think that's everything. Oh, these paintings. Is there anything out here? Oh, my dead cow plant. Can't forget that. I think that should be everything. Piano? I don't need to bring this. I mean, like, I'm gonna redo the bedroom, so I don't really need to bring all the furniture again. Um, there was a photo in the kitchen, was there? Oh, there was. Good call. Might bring these little pictures too, but we don't need to bring everything. Um, it's more just like the things like the 10,000 simoleon computer and stuff, you know? Um, I don't need to bring the laptop, it's cheap. I can sell it, but like, it's, you know, it's not a big deal. Um, Hannah and Anya and Ugly and Heidi and Jessica and Madison and Mai and Katie and B and Yvonne and Belgian and Anastasia and Bailey and Kay and Superloo and 
Oh my goodness, Nelly and Liz and Luna and Leah and Missy and Mary and Pearly and P Marsh and Lex and uh, Pixie and Astro and Goose and Holly and Fairy and Nina and Mia and Miss Maris and Gabby and Bird and Lala and J Dot and Brittle and Shadora and Drops. Oh my goodness, Alice, Hattie, Zoe, Trash Can, Caitlin. How much should I miss? <laughs> Thank you all so much. Okay. We're gonna have to do the shell tours to on Monday. I was supposed to do the shell tours yesterday, but my internet was out, so it has really thrown a wrench in my plans. <laughs> but we've been meaning to do this all week. Like, I had both of these giant things promised, and so it was, yeah, I already pushed this from Thursday, so we'd have more time today, so. Um, my internet being down yesterday has severely ruined my plans, but, um, We'll have to do that on Monday instead. I'm so sorry. It's so annoying. Trust me, I was so sad yesterday. <laughs> it's so infuriating when you're like excited to do something and then you just can't because like, doesn't work. <laughs> so hopefully we should be okay. Um, anyway, Maya and Arma and Henderson and Big and Alex and Blurred and Nat and Nemesis and Anonymous and Soro and Superlu and Dare, thank you for the subs and stuff too. Okay, I think we should have everything. I think I got all the stuff that we needed. So, with love, I kill this house. Um, one other small thing. We got 97k. That's pretty good. One other small thing is that I want to make it not raining anymore. MC cheats, seasons cheats, change weather. I'm going to make it sunny and cool for the rest of the day because... The weather is unfortunate, and it's ruining my vibes, so. Yeah, the Grim Reaper's here. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Don't worry about Grim. He just, he hangs out, you know? Don't worry about it. <laughs> um, okay, so we've got all of our stuff in the inventory. We're in a new save. Um, I saved as, so that we won't lose our progress before. And I do actually have a few pictures, like reference photos. I'm not going to build anything exact from these. Um, it's more like this is kind of the vibe that I'm going for. So let me explain what's going on in this family first, right? Um, basically, we're starting a new generation right now. So previously, um, we had this Sim was the heir. She's dead. <laughs> um, and her spouse is still alive, but is an elder, I think, possibly at work because they're not, Blake's not here. Um, but anyway, they had a bunch of kids, four kids, that's why all these people are here. Um, one of them, the oldest kid, this one, Pepper, is going to be the next heir. She's gonna be a chef, we think. Um, and also, her future wife, this Sim, Tommy, is gonna be like a farmer. So, I kinda wanna have like a... farmy house. The problem is, we live in the desert. So, that, um sort of interrupts our plans ever so slightly <laughs> because we are in the desert <laughs> so um we have to try and do something that fits the vibe a little bit but i also still want to live in oasis springs um i don't want to move lots i want to stay here because it's kind of fun to stay in the same lot the whole time so um i want to try and do something kind of like this i'm looking at like some of these like craftsman -y houses um, and I feel like this kind of vibe might work. Um, I feel like that gets across, like, the desert and also the farm that I desire. Um, and I feel like this might be okay. So, this is what we're gonna go for. I think this might work for what we're trying to do. This is actually kind of similar to this lot. So, <laughs> um, I feel like this is appropriate. Um... But we're gonna try and do something like that. Um, also, a couple things to note. We need to have some extra bedrooms. Um, I guess my brother Peter could probably move out. He's a young adult now. Um, but we do have two younger siblings that just became teens, so they're not ready to leave yet. Um, and we also have my parents still living here. So we're gonna need, obviously, a bedroom for Pepper, bedroom for her parents, uh, and her two siblings. Um, they might share a room, I guess, and then we could- so we could try and do four bedrooms for now. I think that would be appropriate for the kids that we're gonna have in the future. Um, and I want to have chickens. <laughs> that is, um, so four bedrooms, chickens, farm, um, yeah. <laughs> That's what we're up to. The Grim Reaper's here because I almost killed her brother, but I didn't. He's fine. 
the Sims in this family have um, many a near-death experience. We're used to this on my Twitch channel, though. We're familiar with this. That's normal. <laughs> um, anyway, Grissy and Amanda and Wisp and Oro and Curly and Nocturnal and Royal and Tia and uh, Les and Kels and Jay and Lol and Robin and Olivia and Octagon and Nai and Crunchy and Ken and Sarah and Pi and Mallory and Hitch. Thank you all for the subs and stuff. Okay, so we should be good to go. Yeah, he's still mortified. Don't worry about that. <laughs> you know, just... It's fine. Also, um, oh, what am I gonna do with Ghosty Mama long term? So, um, I'm gonna try and bring her back to life. <laughs> That's my new quest. Um, hence, like, the farmer and the chef relationship romance. We're gonna try and bring Anna back to life. Um, so that's the new goal. Um, we're gonna bring her back to life so she can die again. <laughs> It's really all very exciting, so. Anyway, um, with that being said, we got some work to do. I will say, and I'll warn you in advance, I will probably bulldoze this more than once. Um, I, when building these legacy houses, it is, it is a high pressure, very important build, and I, I will probably bulldoze this more than once. So, I'm just warning you. <laughs> This is not a first try kind of thing, okay? <laughs> That's true, I didn't bulldoze the townhouses. No, I didn't. Um, I managed to do that in the first try, so maybe we can make it work with this one. Um, anyway, let me open up another uh, OBS so I can record this. I'm gonna post it on YouTube probably. No, definitely I'm gonna post it on YouTube. It's, it's literally for my YouTube channel. <laughs> this build is for my YouTube legacy challenge. So uh, we were definitely gonna be uh, posting this one on YouTube. That is kind of the whole point. <laughs> hey, Robin and Huckleberry and Belgian and Lillian and Shark and Kayla and Twisted and Tori and Ashley and Caitlin and Mars. Thank you for the subs. Okay. Um, oh, geez, I need to look at my pictures again. I'm sorry. I need to think this through a little bit more. We gotta think about shapes. I love the vibes of the exterior of this one. I think this is super cool. Um, I also like this one a lot. The problem that I have with some of the other ones, I love the landscaping on this too. This is so fun. Um, these ones, I also like this one a lot with the green and the, the wood shingles. However, this house is very garage heavy and it's the Sims 4. So we, we can't do that. Like we won't do the garages that have to be rooms, but I love the color scheme of this one. Like this is very much, I think the vibes. Um, this one, I didn't like the color so much, but I liked the angle. I think it was kind of cool. Same with this. I don't like this one is very garage heavy as well, but I liked the angle of it. Um, know what that house needs? A horse. <laughs> Somebody call Hope. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, a horse would be very appropriate for all of these, I think. Anyway, we'll figure it out. Yeah, lots of the seasons pack in these, mm -hmm, for sure. <laughs> seasons is is definitely gonna be making an appearance with these. All right, I think I might try and do some diagonal. Am I gonna regret that? Probably. Mm -hmm. Let's figure it out. <laughs> Let's just go for it, besties. If it goes wrong, it goes wrong. I'm gonna do it way in the back too, because the lighting is better. Um. We're gonna do the Shell Challenge Tours on Monday, Bestie. I'm so sorry, my internet was out yesterday and I couldn't stream. I'm so annoyed too, this sucks. Um, but we're gonna do the Shell Tours on Monday because we couldn't do them yesterday. Yeah, I like that the Grim Reaper is here too. I feel like the Grim Reaper being here is, is really appropriate. <laughs> There's just something about Grim being here still that is really speaking to me, you know? It just feels right. I, I really, I really enjoy him uh, sticking around for us. <laughs> it just, it's nice and cozy. He's part of the family. Okay, I kind of wish that it was more like this. Oh my God, I'm gonna regret this so much when I do the interior. Why do I do things like this to myself? Like, why, why would I make it diagonal like this? <sighs> I 
It's fine. It's gonna be beautiful and we're gonna love it, besties. It's gonna be fine. The floor plan is gonna be fun. Oh yeah. I look forward to it. Um, I think I might be able to sneak a second floor up here. Um, I'm not sure how small of one, but I think I might be able to sneak one. We're gonna try it. This is gonna be interesting. Hear me out, okay? There's potential in this. I feel like I want there to be like a little bit of a porch here in the front. Might make this even bigger. Next shell with a diagonal. I'll put a shell with a diagonal on the next one. I'll, I'll do that. We haven't done a diagonal shell in a while. You thought my basement shell was bad this time. Oh, get ready for the diagonal shell next time. <laughs> Somebody said, who said that? Whose idea was that? Don't give her any ideas. <laughs> I think I'm gonna do it. It's fun. You know? It's exciting, it's fresh. It's different. It makes everyone in chat cry. <laughs> I don't know if this is gonna be good or not. The upstairs is gonna be super weird on this. Um, but that might even be cool. Like there's something about the upstairs being odd that is like kind of exciting, you know? Um, you need to go in. No, 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 come back. Like I said, might end up bulldozing this one, besties, but it's all for fun. <laughs> it's all fun and games. You like the design? I think it's kind of cool too. I feel like the upstairs is kind of cute. It's it's nice and small up there, which is also kind of fun. Um, I will say that this is perhaps a bit wider than I wanted it to be, but. I don't know. Hunter, Mim Bam, T Love, and Angel, and Dan, and Blanche, and Daisy, and Sammy, and Snarky, and Rachel, and Laura, and Maria, and Ansley. Thank you all so much. Yeah, this is for our YouTube Legacy Ghost. Um, it will be. Okay, we need to make sure this is the same height as like the other one. Same angle, at least. I don't know. Um, I don't know what to do with this. <laughs> I don't know where to like stop it, you know? It's hard to um, combine those things, I feel like. That's, that's what I'm struggling with right now. This is weird. Um, we're gonna do the shells on Monday. I, I was supposed to do it yesterday, but my internet was down and so I couldn't stream yesterday. It was very upsetting, but we're gonna do it on Monday. Um, now that we're, cause I promised I would do this for a while. So it's kind of throwing a wrench in our plans basically. All right, I don't know about this. <laughs> I don't think I like it that much. Um, I think that's my current problem. Maybe I'll have this be like this kind of roof instead. You like it? It's different. It definitely is different. I kind of like it too, but I'm not sure. I'm just not sure. Um. I might try and get like two dormers maybe. Or maybe if there was like something else in here. Watch there be a bulldoze in a minute. Oh, there might be a bulldoze in a minute. I, I tried to warn you. <laughs> 
<laughs> Listen, I don't know what I'm doing yet. <laughs> I may bulldoze this randomly. It may happen. <laughs> Farmhouse in a desert? Yes. That is what I'm going for. Yes, indeed. Thank you. Um, I've been living in the desert the whole time, and I don't really want to move out of the desert. But I also am aware that it's um, peculiar. Okay? I know. You might say it's a ranch. Right. But, you know, lacking a few ranch-like things. <laughs> um, you don't have to stay in the same lot, but traditionally in a legacy challenge you would. Um, which is kind of why I wanted to. But you definitely don't have to. That's, that's kind of a personal preference. Um, I think it's kind of exciting to live in the same lot the whole time. It's also been interesting for me as a person who doesn't normally uh, build or play in Oasis Springs. It's been kind of interesting um, trying to, to do things in Oasis Springs and like do builds in Oasis Springs because I, I usually don't. Oh my God, I hate it. It's like so many roofs. <laughs> oh no. But yeah, I don't usually, um, play in Oasis Spring, so it's it's giving McMansion a little bit. That's okay. Oh god. Okay. Maybe if we had a chimney. Would that help split it up a little bit? I'm probably gonna bulldoze it. I can I can feel the bulldoze coming. I kind of, I don't know about her. <laughs> I don't know if I like it or not. I'm really trying to make it look nice, but I just don't think it does. It's so weird. It's like actually so weird. The floor plan is really weird too. I don't know. I don't know. I kind of wish that I had more, um, of a porch. What if this was the back? What if we made this the back? Oh, so this is the front? Um. Okay, besties, we gotta, hang on. Let's look at it. Let's see what we can, did I not rotate? I thought I rotated it. Let's see what we can do. If we did this as the, um, if we did this as the front, we could have more of a porch. Which might be a good thing. Oh, someone said please no. Oh, that's a bad sign. <laughs> oh God. Listen, listen, I've got a plan, okay? It's fine. <laughs> it's gonna be okay. I just gotta get there first, is all. We just gotta get through it first. Don't worry. Okay. It looks so nice. What? It's still there. I just rotated it. <laughs> it's not like it's gone, bestie. Calm down. It's okay. 
as I said, this is gonna be a process, all right? We're gonna be here for a while. This is not a, oh my God, I literally hate it. I think the build's ugly. <laughs> Journey Cat, oh, let us play Anna, Sweet Nightmare, Luna, Leah, Digital, loves to write. Oh no. You think the diagonal is throwing it off? I mean, the diagonal might be throwing it off. We could just like, hang on, this is the front again. Hear me out. We're working on it. This is the front again. <laughs> oh, I hope that you never have to build a house in front of this many people. <laughs> I say this to you with love. I hope that you never have to do this. It's so scary. I don't even know what I want it to look like. Oh no. Okay. Lower the foundation. We could do too high instead. Um, I want to have a little bit of it though. Make the diagonal longer. You want it to be bigger? I mean, we could. Does that help? This, it looks like a McMansion. It's, it's really like a, a Texas McMansion at the moment. That's very much the vibes that it's giving me, um, which is not necessarily a positive. I won't lie to you. I, I don't mean that as a compliment. What if we did a chimney here? That's kind of cool. Okay. Okay. I feel like there's potential. Lower, you want it to be shorter? We can make it shorter again. I mean, that's easy. Shorter chimney. Okay, I think that's that's helping it come together. And then once we get like some accents, listen, listen, we're gonna have like, oh my god, <laughs> maybe okay, wait, maybe it's maybe it's not on, um, a foundation. Maybe it's flat. That's just straight up ugly. I'm sorry, but that's not gonna happen. Do I put the columns there? For the front? Bulldoze it, bestie. All right, Louie Bug, you're being rude. I like it. I've got a vision. I promise I do have an idea. It's It'll come back, don't worry. We gotta think about the back again later. <laughs> I don't like the back. <laughs> that's, a, that's a problem for later though. Keeping in mind that these were the kind of things we were going for, right? We're going for some houses kind of like this. So this was always the plan, okay? Um, <laughs> um, hey, Oro and Fess and Noxie and Dancing and Alex and Laza and Renny and thank Kat, thank you all for the subs. Um, I think once we get it a little bit further along, it's gonna be okay. Trust the process, all right? It's gonna take us a bit, but once we get there, we will be happy. Oh, I hate the back. I literally hate the back. We have to come back to that. I'm sorry, but it's not gonna work. Um, okay. And then, The back isn't even that bad. You know what? That's nice of you to say. 
Thank you. That's actually very kind of you to say. We do have like some seasons um stuff. I don't know if I want to use that though. I don't really vibe with that. But there is some season stuff. If we decide we want it. I don't know if I like that or not. No stone on second floor columns. We can use different columns. These columns are from seasons. Um, the problem is we need to make sure it matches the same color scheme, but I feel like maybe the ones from Snowy Escape, or honestly, even these ones might. These are the cats and dogs ones. Even that might work. It's thinner. Okay. I'm doing this because I want to get like a different color on the roof and on the first floor, so. Remove the roof's overhangs. You want it to have like a renovated vibe. You don't want to have any overhangs on the roof. I don't know if I want to do that. I, I want to have um, overhangs because I want to put like, I want to get some fun sort of like craftsman-y detail like these to support them. That was kind of the vision that I was having. Um, and I want to sort of stick to that, I think. Does that make sense? We actually have seasons ones that are probably better than these, but I might size the seasons ones down because the seasons ones are very large. But that was kind of what I was envisioning. Go up. We're gonna be here all day. I'm warning you right now. <laughs> this is gonna be a long stream. <laughs> you want me to extend the roof overhangs to them? Do you think? Do you think that it being that wide is weird? I don't know. We can think about it. It might be kind of cute, actually. It definitely has more style, which is good. That's what it needed, so. Yeah, that makes way more sense with the detailing. Oh, I actually kind of like it. It's kind of cool. <laughs> I kind of like this build. Okay, this is good. I'm glad. This is what we needed. Some inspiration. I don't want to overhang that more. I might just leave it. Save the game. Okay. Danielle, Juliet, Yumi, and Natalie, and Aiden, Trashy, and Smorley, and Quinlan, and Rebecca, and Ben. Thank you for the subs. So glad you didn't bulldoze. Yeah. <laughs> well, we might still. Don't get your hopes up. <laughs> it's not too late. We could still bulldoze it. You never know. When I'm building these houses, I've been known to do it quite a few times, so. <laughs> ah! Why does it do that? Okay. I fixed it. <laughs> that was scary. <laughs> I didn't like that at all. Okay. Um, let me get... We want the stone from Seasons. And we want it to be kind of like the brown one on that chimney. Oh, that's gonna be perfect. I love it. Okay. 
Um, I might use this on the roof. I kind of like this. I feel like it's coming along. But people, now that we can see the vision, right? We all are on the same page. Are we all good now? <laughs> that we know what we're trying to do? <laughs> A more brownish roof? We could try and do something like that. Um, that might be cute. I honestly kind of like that one. Okay. Let's get some windows. Hopefully a lot of them as well. I want a very, very large number of windows. That is my dream. Let's do a big one. Maybe you think a metal roof? We could maybe do a metal roof. I'll have to think about that. I'm, I don't hate that idea, so. We can look into it. Um, okay. Like that. Rodent room, we can do that, okay. <laughs> that's another idea, that's, that's definitely an interesting idea. <laughs> Sure, sure. Okay. Is it better centered with the roof or with the wall? What do you think? I think with the roof. We'll put some landscaping there to kind of cover it. So hopefully it's like less weird. Zell, Bree, AJ, Irene, Mazzy, Miss, and Drew, and Danielle, and Juliet. Thank you for the subs. Okay, we'll get um, a little door, too. It's actually a very nice big door. <laughs> okay. Someone said metal roof earlier. Which is definitely an idea. I might... We have to think about this. I'm not really sure. Get windows on each of those. Very HGTV. <laughs> That's a good way of describing it. It's very HGTV. <laughs> Imagine how hot it would be. Oh yeah, it would be very hot. I mean, I guess... Um... The solar shingle roof. No, I, t I can't. I don't like that. <laughs> I can't. Erica, best is celebrate. Thank you for the subs. Oh, we can come back to it. I'm not really sure what I want it to look like on there. So we'll have to revisit that on the roof. Um, we also have to revisit the back of the house because I don't really like how it looks um, at the minute. I'm not really a fan. Um. Oh, this is the front of the house, by the way. I'm, I started building it backwards because the lighting is bad on the lot. Um, but this is, this is the back of the house. Um. I don't know. Probably want to get something else going over here. I feel like part of the problem is, is that it's so like rotated that way, you know? Like the whole house is very, it just needs like some more pizzazz to it. I think is part of the problem. Is that, oh. We got a nice porch. 
We could probably put like some kind of partial bit there just to have more windows because there's not really a big upstairs or a lot. Oh my God, that's so ugly. <laughs> there's not really a lot of space upstairs or a lot of windows upstairs. So like the idea of a sunroom slash greenhouse. Yeah, but where, how would we stick that on? Where would that go? Um, as a separate building? Okay. We could try and have like, hang on, let me think about this. I almost want to try and have a uh, greenhouse attached. I think that could be cool. Let me just kill this then. I need to redo it. Um, the roof won't clip that much during gameplay, but don't worry, I'm gonna, um, I'll try and fix it. I'm gonna try and fix the roof clipping once I'm done with like the build. I wanna work on the build a little bit more and then we can fix the roof clipping once we start working on the inside. The house is huge. This is the back. It's flipped backwards right now, Blair. Um, this is actually gonna be the back of the house. It's just flipped backwards because I was, um, the lighting is bad, so <laughs> I flipped it around. I'm wondering if I could try and get some sort of like, um, I was gonna have it be like an attached greenhouse, but I don't know how to put it on there. Or how to... Don't like the metal roof? Oh, but people in chat yell at me to make it metal. <laughs> we can change it. I'm not, I haven't settled on the roof yet. I don't know what I'm going to do yet, so don't worry. It's not stuck. Um... Yeah, um, it's hard to make attached greenhouses look good. I very much agree with you. It's like really hard to pull that off, so. <laughs> I don't know how I wanna do it. Um, look at that. No clipping. And we can fix that clipping easily. I'd wanna make like some sort of really cool attached segment. Oops, clipping outside. I know this part's clipping. I'm not done with the back yet. It's not done. Don't. Ignore anything in the back. The, the back, you, I take no criticism on because I'm not even close to being done. <laughs> Glider, Munchkin, Holly, thank you for the subs. Um, <sighs> make the attached bit more central. The problem is we have to have some sort of bump out to continue this roof line. We need to continue this roof line a little bit. Um, Cause that's the only way that it's gonna blend in with the roof in the front. So it has to be a little bit of this. Um, we could go for it being like genuinely even bigger. Like what if we did it Something like that. That is enormous. Hmm. Maybe like two smaller. 
One, two, go away. That's the same as it was before. <laughs> so never mind. I didn't even do anything to make it smaller. <sighs> um, greenhouse could be off the diagonal in the back. That's true. Do you think it would be weird if we had like a big space? I mean, I'm kind of making at this point like a little, it's almost like, oh God, it's almost like a little courtyard that's gonna be. Invalid diagonal intersection, okay. Oh no. I don't know if I want to do it off the side of this. This house is for the Bell family, yeah. It makes the shape like really odd. Um, okay, let's think about this. GMG, thank you for 11 months. Juan and TT and Hop and Holly and Munchkin, thank you for the subs, all of you too. Okay, it's gonna have to be like that. And then maybe there would be like, This part would be the glass. I don't like that. It's scary, I don't. <laughs> I want it to be attached because I think it would be cool, but I just don't know how to make it look not weird, you know? But that's kind of how we would do it if we had it over here. What if it came off of this part? Like, what if we did, like, the greenhouse back here? And we had it like that. Kind of attached, kind of not. Maybe that would be okay. We just go for something sim more simple. It doesn't have to be so complicated, you know? That could work. And once we get some stuff like added to it and everything, it might come together. We'll have to get like a thicker trim on it. Can I do? Uh, I wonder if I could put this here or if it would not let me. I think it's gonna like keep deleting itself. Column can't be any shorter, boo. Fine. Yeah, and once it's like all windows exactly, it'll be cool. Um. Oh, wait. That's weird. This whole thing is weird. Paneled glass room? I mean, we could do a paneled one. I don't, I didn't decide, I haven't like decided on what it's gonna be like yet, but. Yeah, you can grow plants inside. Yeah, so we'll be able to grow the plants in there, which will be what we're kind of aiming for with this. <sighs> okay. Your cow just ran away. Oh no. Do you. I assume you mean in The Sims. <laughs> um, even so, I'm, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I didn't know they could do that. July, Evie, Pan, Norris, Adsa, and Mojo, and Vidna, and Jessica, thank you for the sub. Does the cow just like walk out? Is that how that works? in the game. Are they like, no, I'm, I'm done, I'm out. 
and they just go away. <laughs> Because that's fascinating. Okay. This is very similar to how we had it before. I like deleted everything and then redid it just to put it back. So. Um. I think that would be good. I want the roof trim to put around that a little because I need some like separation. <laughs> no lemon, thank you for the subs. All right, I think that's okay. I feel like this is growing on me. And once we get like the windows and stuff back here and it starts to look like the front and, and more put together, I think it'll be like all good. I do think I might, I didn't love how this looked. Um. I, I won't lie. However, uh, I do think that having this up here, like a little bit extra wall space, um, even though I don't love how the roof looks on it, I think that it being here will be a positive because there'll be more light. We can put windows there on the inside of the upstairs. Um, and I think that'll be a good thing. So I might um, expand it a little bit. <sighs> we could probably have a couple bedrooms up there. So that'll be nice. One thing is there's gonna be like no windows on this whole back part. <laughs> um, yeah, and the back of the house can be weird. That's kind of, that's kind of realistic, honestly, to have a slightly odd like back to the house, so. Um, well, maybe I'll just put all these like this. Some windows there. I don't know. Come here. Stop. Oh my gosh. Why is it doing that? Whatever. Never mind. I don't care. <sighs> I'm angry. We can have less of an overhang on that, maybe. And then if we scoot them, what if I scooted them up? Are you serious? Why does it do that? I don't know if I like that or not. Oh, you like the overhang? Oh, okay. We have to put the trim pieces back too. Oops, wrong button. Come here. This is gonna help, I think, once we get all of this together. The greenhouse is so weird. <laughs> I know I kind of like that it's weird, but the greenhouse really is super weird. I won't lie. It's it's definitely odd. All right, let's replace those with this piece. Okay, I'm still unsure about this area. Um, You think different glass roof with the metal? Yeah, I, um... I don't know. I need to pick what windows I'm gonna put on this first. Cause I feel like once I have the windows in, I'll have a better idea of how I want it to look. I might use these ones from... But the problem that I have with this is when I put the glass roof and like all the windows, I always feel like it looks weird. That's why I wanted to use the solid one. Um, Cause I felt like it looked better, but I don't know. What do you think? It's not very deserty. Julie, I kind of like how it looks in the desert. Um, 
hopefully once we get it all landscaped and stuff with some more like deserty landscaping, you might like it. Um, hopefully I can change your mind. Okay. Also, maybe if I show you some pictures, you'll understand what we're going for. So here's some of the, oops, here's some of the things we were looking at. Um, sorry, trying to decide what to build. We were kind of going for some things like this. Obviously not all these are in the desert, but we were kind of trying to do some stuff sort of like this. Um, and trying to do that vibe a little bit with the build, so. Rini, Cassidy, Luna, Sunbear, Maya, Cass, and so, and Teresa, and Nell, thank you for the subs, too. Um, okay. I think once we get some more stuff like that, too, it'll all sort of tie in. I don't like how this part looks. I wanted to have some more windows up there, but I don't like it, so. Is there anything else I can do to alter it? Well, maybe I'll just make it a little bit. Mm. Is it worth doing that just to have, it's not even gonna add any extra windows. I just don't like how it looks. I need something else in there. At least we'll have windows on this wall too, which will help, but Maybe I'll just leave it. I don't know. Might just leave it and see how I feel. Um, that's a window. A lot of the windows we're probably gonna end up adjusting based on um, the interior. Like we'll probably end up moving them around a little bit, depending on what we do the floor plan as. So. We don't have to finish the whole thing straight away. We can at least get one up there, which will help too. Maybe a balcony? A balcony up top? Oh, geez. <laughs> um, where would, how? Where would we put it? lower the pitch to the glass roof? You think it should be different than the rest of it? I mean, we can. I don't know. I'm not sure that a balcony is gonna um, fit with this so well. This is the back of the house. Yeah, Jenny, this is the back of the house. Um. I'm not sure about the, I also, I think I might put the roof pattern back to this. I don't know. I'm not really sure about the roof texture yet, but I don't think I like the metal. I don't think I like that either. Ugh. I don't know what I want it to look like. What if we did? Maybe that's better. I think I like that one, the snowy escape one. Okay, I feel a lot better about that. I think that looked nice. It's kind of like an in-between of the shingles and the metal, you know? Okay. <laughs> you in kinda, Lil Salty, Rini, thank you for the subs too. Okay, so color scheme wise, I really like this one. I think this is really cool. I like the green. I don't know if we have that, but <laughs> I really like that kind of thing. So I might try and do something sort of similar to that. Um, I'm gonna look at the uh, seasons wallpapers. 
We do have green, but I don't know if I like that particular green. Oh no. Maybe the lighter one, that's kind of green-ish. Maybe. Is that the same color? No. That one. It's actually gray. But... Do we like that with the rest of the house? Or should we go for more of like a... No, I think I like this one. And we wanna, we'll have to tie in some extra textures. We aren't gonna just do this everywhere, don't worry. But I might paint it everywhere first and then we can like change more parts of it. But we're not gonna paint the whole house that color, obviously. We just gotta like. I loved how the shingles looked on that picture of the other house, but I guess our shingles are like so uniform. I don't know if I like it. And I also want the stone back. Which one is it? Should I do like stone stone on this whole piece? Maybe some shingles up there, too. Hmm. I think this is coming together. It kind of looks like a mountain house. <laughs> Except it's in the desert. <laughs> um, but I kind of like it. I think it's kind of cool. It's a deserty mountain house. All right, let's see if we can tie in some more of this in the back too. We'll do that same stuff around here. Might put shingles there as well. See, remember when I said trust the process? It was gonna come together. Just, just needed some time. <laughs> It just needed some time for it to get there. It was definitely weird in the beginning, but you know, it, it all eventually makes sense. Okay, we gotta put the, these things in here too. Can I put it on the gallery? Yeah, once I finish it, I will. Um, we'll stick it on the gallery once it's done. Always do. Love that. Okay, I might make some more stone there. I'm trying to think. I don't like the back of the house that much. Hey, how is great under the roof? I know the look of like that, the under roof texture really throws off the vibes. That happens all the time. This house, I'm not noticing it as much, but sometimes when I build like log cabins and like the whole house is logs and then you like get it from the underside angle and it's like this like stark gray roof. Ah, oh, it's horrible. I, some of the roof textures, um, like some of them have an underside to it. Like the ones from Island Living do, but, um, not any of the ones like this. So annoying. The ceilings just like throw you off so much. Okay. I'll probably put like a wood here. We'll have to get a really interesting pathway leading up to the front because the, the desert is not the vibe. Um, yeah, I would love to have ceiling painting make a return in this game. One of these days. I'm literally begging them. 
Should I put that all around the whole thing? How does that look? Oh, that actually might be okay. Well, hang on. What if I got the... Oh, that's better. Way better. Never mind. Problem solved with that. Okay. Put that there too. We can get like a nice patio in the back. Oh, it's gonna be great. Um, I'm so excited. <laughs> can I paint this wall to match? That looks way better. All right. One other thing I wanna do is put another piece of that. Oh, that's so annoying. Because of the glass roof, it's gonna, all right. It's just gonna have to be that way. Can't see it on the inside because of the glass. Um, Grim Reaper is there because um, one of my sims had a bit of an oopsie in my pond. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Don't worry about it. But uh, one of my sims had a bit of an oopsie and I managed to plead for him successfully. So it's fine. <laughs> Shells, Shannon, Katie, Sven, GS, and Babs, and Ellie, and Theme, and uh, Veal, and Muffin, and Jenny, and Kai, they are the subs. <laughs> you know, oopsie might not be the right word. It was, it was, um, how do I say this? Um, fully my fault. But he's fine. He's good. <laughs> he survived it. It was an attempted murder, sure, whatever, if you want to call it that. <laughs> but he's fine. <laughs> Kai, thanks for the 15 months. He just took a little swim, is all. He just, he just went for like a little bit of a swim. Does this come in like a more brown color? Yes! Oh my god, that looks so good together! Perfect. Perfect. Okay. I might put some plants in that little space. Oh, I'm obsessed. This is the back of the house, by the way. You might not be able to tell, because I've got it rotated the wrong way on purpose, but this is the back of the house. <laughs> um... Okay, I think I might... Oops. Can I not? Oh my god, that's so annoying. I think I want to have the... Maybe I'll do it like that instead. I'm just thinking I want to put some landscaping in that area. And then we can have the, f the patio, like, go right up to it you know, which might be kind of cool. Okay, I messed up a little bit, but. By the way, if you press Control F, um, you can get the little diagonal tiles to do that. Little quarter tiles. <sighs> Looks nice. Shall I put my fence? I'm gonna have to put the fence back again after this because I'm gonna rotate the lot and it's gonna get messed up, but should I scoot it over on the lot, maybe? Or am I gonna put the farm in the back? We'll have the farm in the back too. It'll all fit. There's plenty of space, don't worry. Um, we'll get the farm in the back though. Like back here. Um, and we'll have a lot of patio space, hopefully. Look at that. It's kind of cool. We could also put, like, some grass. You can't stop me. I can have grass if I want it. Oh, it's gonna be beautiful. <laughs> Lena, Maria, Pinky, Fallen, Kai, thank you for the subs. And then keeping in mind, there's basically gonna be like grass in these areas too. We're just gonna um, put some landscaping on them. So 
So I might end up deleting the tiles, but if it helps to green grass. Yeah, fake grass. <laughs> Um, we'll probably do a little bit of landscaping in that section, and then maybe I'll... Maybe just that wide. And we'll have that be the width of the patio. That's enough space in the front yard, probably, too. So this, this could be... how the house ends up looking. You know? And we'd have, like, all the landscaping would be back here with the, all the crops, I should say. Shiny grass. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> you know, we might, we might do terrain paint instead. We might do terrain paint instead of that. <laughs> Tommy, Lena, Maria, Pinky, thank you for the subs. It might be a little bit too shiny for me. We can have a sort of interesting shaped pool. That could be fun. Could even be like that, to be honest. And we could have like some little lounge chairs right there. Maybe I'll like, I don't know, is that cool? I can't really tell. I don't usually do stuff like this, so. <laughs> Undecided on that. Yeah, it's kind of like a diamond a little bit. Um, we never even use the pool, really. So we barely even need that, but oh well. All right, let's try and do some landscaping in the front because this is what really matters. Um, this is what you're gonna see. This is how we're gonna impress the neighbors. Um, I might try and get some, like, very deserty landscaping. And by that, I mean, I might put, like, um, let me show you. Let me show you. Where's my gravel? I mean, if we had, like, some... Plants like this, kind of in there. Cactus, you know, and we put it in the gravel. Neighbors, aka family. Okay, fair enough, that's true. My neighbors across the street are my family. <laughs> um, we'll have to put some like further over this way. We want it to be around the chimney too, probably. Ooh. It's a bit tight. Go away. Go away. Maybe like that. I've got an idea. I just have to like do something to sort of embrace it. So picture like that whole thing is filled in, okay? And then in debug, show hidden objects, show live edit objects. We could get some of those debug stones, like stepping stones. Should put a gate to the back. Oh yeah, we don't have a gate to the back from the front. Eh, they don't need it. But we could get some like debug stepping stones and have them in the middle here. Kind of like, that's a bit smaller than I wanted it to be. Can I do? Hmm. Do I like that? I'm not sure. Are the big ones okay? What if it was like, 
and then one skinnier one. The get together ones are are like rugs that look like stones too. That's also an idea. I wanted this to work, but I don't think they look good. They're like too gray. I think the same is gonna go for the get together ones. Um, I guess the get together ones at least come in beige. I don't think I wanna do circles. It's like, I need it to be big. I want it to be very large. And we can put some terrain paint underneath it. I don't want it to be like... It's kind of odd. We can put some terrain paint underneath it to try and like tie it together. I don't think it looks good. Dang it. What else could we do? Why does it have to be three wide? I mean, we could always like make a sort of custom driveway kind of thing. Like keeping in mind that it's, this is the back of the house still, we have to flip it. But, um, The color of the gravel isn't the same, which is also infuriating. That might be okay. If it was like one. And what if we put like, some sort of thing in here to kind of like, separate it somehow. If we got like, I don't know, a platform or something to like, or we'll put some landscape, well, let's just put some landscaping like right here even. I don't know, fountain maybe. I think once we get it together, it'll be better. And then we can always rotate it back. I'm just, I'm building it like this backwards because the lighting is better. Um, so I feel like if I do it like this, it's easier. Okay, you know what else? We can use some of those debug trees, those olive trees from um, the wedding pack. Cause I feel like those are kind of similar to the, some of these like brushy bushes that we have, but it's better cause it's, it's, big and at least we can have a tree. I really want to have trees. Like some kind of trees are important to me, so. Where'd the pond go? We haven't put it back yet. We're gonna put it in the backyard though. Don't worry. I need my death pond still. Can't, can't get rid of it. The pack that shall not be named. <laughs> yeah, sorry for bringing it up. <laughs> I, I shouldn't have mentioned it. <laughs> the wedding pack, it hurts to think about. Yeah, the triangle floor, you can press control F to get it. Hey, Pink, um, and Aiden, and Sarah, and MZ, and Jay, and Distracts, and Retro, and Nest, and Bruin, and Elise, uh, Zombie, Danielle, Schmicky, and Adele, and Titular, and Lena, and Marie, thank you so much. Um, okay, this'll be good. We'll get it all filled in. Might be able to fit one like, probably not actually. Never mind, it's too close. Too close. Um, this is for the bells, yeah, Max. My YouTube series legacy. Um, I'm gonna save the game again. It's been a while, so ooh. 
No, Haldora, are you putting in the cheats right? You gotta use two cheats. You'll have debug landscaping if you have no pack still. You just gotta use um, bb.showHiddenObjects and then bb.showLiveEditObjects and then search debug. Um, it's not easy to find. Yeah, there's some really good Strangerville plants. That's a good point. Um, Strangerville will have some good stuff too. There's like loads of really good cactus type stuff that we can get um, from debug. I'll have to tie these in somehow. Oh my gosh. <laughs> This is fun. We also have these trees, which are kind of interesting. Um, we can maybe put, we could probably put one of those right here, actually. Why not? I have never used one of those. Could be cool. Maybe I'll put a couple or another one over here or something. It's interesting. I love this. It's like so different than what we normally build, so. Okay, we definitely want to use some of these. The question is how, like, how um, organized do we want the, oh my God. <laughs> how organized do we want this to look? Because we could definitely get like a kind of, um, I don't know, we could like line up some cactus plants. We could also sort of just place them willy nilly. I mean, we got options. We haven't done the inside yet. No, Mickey, we haven't done the inside yet. We have a lot to do still. Oh, we could put this over here. That'll fill up this area pretty nicely, actually. It's a fun opportunity to use some different types of plants. I think we need it to be a balance between organized and random. Yeah, I'm with you. I don't like this one that much. Um, these are looking a bit brown because it's winter in my game right now, but it'll hopefully look better once the seasons change back. Don't worry. It's unfortunate timing. <laughs> It's gonna be green in the, in the summer and spring, <laughs> so. <laughs> this is not for the POTS legacy, no. This is for my Bell legacy. It's my, the YouTube series that I do. Um, Caitlin, I wanna stay in Oasis Springs. Um, I'm kinda trying to build something a little bit different in Oasis Springs right now. I don't know if you can tell, but we're sorta trying to do something that we haven't really done before. Um, and I'm having a lot of fun doing it, so. I think it looks cool. Um, I might put some of this back here. Did I really, could I, oops. I don't think it let me have it all the way up. I wonder if it'd be better like this. I feel like that's a little bit better, to be honest. And we can try and get some more of this, oops. Oh no, I'm gonna have to do so much of this. Yeah, don't worry about Grim. He's just hanging out. Um, it's, it's his house too. He's part of the family at this point. He spends so much time with us. So, <laughs> don't worry about it. <laughs> He's allowed to stay. <laughs> um, just don't worry about it. <laughs> Daisy, Sil, Hades, uh, Amazon, Vanessa, and Glover, and Little Tika, thank you all so much. Um, yeah, debug landscaping does change with seasons, yes. Um, it does change with the seasons. Okay, maybe I'll put one of these down here. Ew, look at what that looks like in the winter. That's what it's supposed to look like with a pink flower. That's that's it in the winter. Oh my God, that's so ugly. <laughs> oh, wow. 
Did I keep the gravestones? Don't worry, Pastel, this is a different legacy than the one that you're used to seeing with the graves. Um, this, is a, this is a different uh, save file. So there's not a whole bunch of graves in the front yard in this one. There's only a couple graves in the front yard in this one, and I do still have them. <laughs> only a couple graves, she says. <laughs> Don't worry, we just have two. <laughs> Um, but that's that's the legacy that you're thinking of on my Twitch channel has all the graves. I might try and use this gray stone. Um, maybe we could get like a. I don't know. I want something down here. But the stones look. I don't know how to fill in these little desert patches. See, I feel like this part is kind of good for doing like some kind of slightly more uniform landscaping. We can use these little ones in that front area. What's the difference between the YouTube legacy and the Twitch legacy? I've just got different families we're playing with. They're different save files. I feel like that's cute. Is this okay? Do you like how that looks? This is very unfamiliar territory for me. I will um, make sure that is clear to you. <laughs> I live in Florida. <laughs> um, I don't really have uh, desert landscaping around me. <laughs> this is like very, very different um, than the kind of things that I'm used to seeing. We got, we got like tropical landscaping around these parts, you know, so. Um, I'm trying to do the best that I can, but this is definitely new to me. <laughs> um, okay. Yeah, I think the limited plants is, is cool though. Um, you're obsessed with this house. I'm glad that you like it. I'm, I'm really liking this too. I feel like, um, I'm really happy with what we decided to do. I feel like it's, it's gonna come out really cool. So. We did good, everybody. We did good. Um. No, I don't want to do that. <laughs> oh. Maybe I'll do like a combo of this one with this in front of it. And then maybe we could get another like, I don't know, maybe one of these again. We have some different colors of them. That one's a bit brighter, so that could be okay. And then we could put a little rock somehow with it. I think that fills it in pretty well. It's giving me Disney Big Thunder Mountain in the best way. <laughs> it is kind of like Big Thunder Mountain Railroad. <laughs> That's a good way of describing it, I think. I agree with you. Um, <laughs> Audrey, Jody, Marvel, Martin, Megan, and Haley, and Daisy, and Joe. Um, it looks like something from your hometown in Las Vegas. Yeah, that's kind of what we're going for a little bit. Um, I feel like this part is a little bit busy. Oh, the lighting is terrible, but that's okay. I like it. Busy is not necessarily a bad thing. Um, okay. Maybe I will put one of Maybe I will put that. That's so large. <laughs> it's such a giant cactus. I kind of like it, but it really is very large, isn't it? Um, maybe I'll size that down. Okay. <laughs> oh my goodness. Um. Maybe if we got like a few of these things kind of lined up there. Trying to get something a little bit more uniform, you know? 
maybe this could go in front of them. Okay. Maybe we could do something similar with that. Over here. Oops. <sighs> what do we think? Is it coming along or does it look weird? Some jungle adventure plans could work too. Yeah, we have things like this. It's so hard to use them though right now in the winter because it looks ugly. <laughs> That's the thing, they look like actually ugly right now in the winter because all the plants are dead, so. It doesn't help. <laughs> Maybe we could just stick a little rock. I wonder if I could like size up a rock. How big does that get? You know what? A slightly larger rock might be a positive for this space. I kind of like it. Fireflies. Ooh, good idea. Let's put like a whole bunch of them around. I'm I'm very pleased with um, how that's coming along. So I like that folder. That's a nice folder. <laughs> Beans, Nicole, Jenna, Jody, Audrey. Thank you for the subs. Okay, um, let me think. I'll try and get some more fireflies back. You think less plants, really? Should I have less, even less? Um, I think it's balanced okay. I might leave it for now. We do need a mailbox. Um, I think I might put it, I feel like this mailbox could be a really good way to like do the dividing between these two spaces. So I could do it like that. And I was thinking about getting a, a large rock, believe it or not. A large rock kind of partly on the path and partially down here. I don't know what to put on it. I just want to get a little bit of plants. One extra one. Just something else to fill it in. And we can do some terrain paint and stuff to hopefully blend it out a little bit better. The house is backwards, yeah, Brian. It's because the lighting is really bad from the front, so we built it backwards. Um, but we're about to switch it back now that the house is pretty much done, from the outside at least. But I built it backwards because the lighting is better. Okay. I'm liking that. Let's switch it around and let's work on the inside a little bit because the inside is gonna take us a very long time, so. <laughs> it's gonna delete my fence too, yeah. That's fine. It's just a fence. Easy fix. That is so annoying though, how it does that. Oh, and it like rotated my terrain paint or at the very least it looks bad from this direction. So I might just redo it at the end. Oh, I do like this house. I, I do like this house. I did one try it. I didn't have to bulldoze it. I did it all in one shot. <sighs> okay. Megs, Emma, Molly, Opal, Good Life, Beans, Nicole. Thank you for the subs. Let's try and get some flooring. Besties, thoughts on the jungle adventure flooring? Ooh. Because I really like it. <laughs> I really like it. Okay. Um, now keeping in mind, the upstairs is actually really small. Do I want to use the darker one? Maybe I do. I might use the darker one. It's kind of purple. Um, the upstairs is really small, so there's probably gonna be like a couple bedrooms up here. I'm also gonna do a little bit to stop with some clipping, I think. Um, that's better. 
much better. Okay. There we go. Mailbox in the back. Oh yeah, look at that. There's a mailbox back there. <laughs> okay, let's figure out the floor plan. Um, I'm thinking the upstairs will probably end up having, like, honestly, maybe two bedrooms. Um, maybe kind of like that. Or like that. Um, so let's see if we can fit a staircase into that space. And if not, um, ooh. I'm not really sure how exactly I want to go about this. What was Christine's idea? I didn't see it. I'm gonna look at message history. <laughs> I'm trying to do stairs, I can't see anything. I almost just banned her instead of clicking on message history. Ranking of the wooden floors in The Sims. That's a funny video idea. I've got opinions, so I'd be down. Um, come on, come around. Okay, I feel like, honestly, it's not that bad. Um, and it's decent upstairs as well, which is cool. So. Do I wanna do it like that? One thing that I don't love is um, the fact that this door would have to be right in the corner. That always bothers me. I really don't like having to do that. I like literally hate it being in the corner, but the rest of it's okay, so. L-shape the stairs. We could try and L-shape them maybe. We could stick them back like that. That might work better for the downstairs anyway. Oh, that fits better. Oh, you know what? Let's do it like that. Okay. This bathroom has enormous window. That's that's not ideal. <laughs> um, it's it's not the best. There's a really big window in there, but that's okay. Um I do like the two kids' rooms up there. Okay, one thing that I kind of wanted to do, but I don't think we can pull off because of the clipping, is, mm-hmm, yeah. <laughs> yep. As I suspected, oh, we might be able to make it work. I want my stairs back. Game. You stole them! Oops, that's the wrong way still. Like this. All right, that is beautiful. And I'm obsessed with it. This is exactly what we wanted. I love how small the upstairs is. I feel like, honestly, it's actually kind of like sneakily big. Um, Cause it doesn't look like there's much of an upstairs at all, but there's actually two bedrooms and a bathroom up there. So that's pretty good. And then downstairs, we gotta fit like two more bedrooms. <laughs> so, you know, that's fine. Everything's fine. <laughs> um, I'm wondering if maybe this could become like, that's so large. Maybe we'll do it like back one. But I'm wondering if maybe, honestly, what if that's the, the parents' bedroom and that's their ensuite bathroom? <clears throat> I think that might be all right. It 
it's a huge bathroom, which is actually kind of nice. And they have a big window. And then we can try and fit another bedroom down here somewhere. Maybe we could try and fit like a... I wonder if we tried to make a little bit of a hallway. Like, I'm gonna try and, like, sneak us around a little, but... I wonder... Mm, the hallway has to be bigger. Because then it can take you that way, too. But what if, like... Um... I don't know what this is back here. This might be bad. I don't think this works. These rooms are so small and the house is so big. I'm just thinking like, well, maybe, what if this is like the entire parents' room? They have a really big room. And then we get like a really big bathroom for them. Their ensuite is like down here. And then... No, because this is where the greenhouse is. We need to have, like, more of a, um... I need to make this more useful space. I don't know what this would be, though. <laughs> And I, I guess, oh my god, do you know what else? That would have been a big mistake, because we don't want the kitchen to be on a diagonal. The bedrooms can be on a diagonal, the kitchen cannot. So, actually, in hindsight, we need this to be, like, the, the living room or the bedrooms. That could have been bad. <laughs> I can't, we can't have the, the kitchen on a diagonal, it's not gonna happen. Although it would be nice if this was the living room. Um... We can have a bathroom in this space. Maybe this is like the parents' bedroom. That's their ensuite bathroom. And that is a really odd shaped kids' room. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh, yikes. Diagonal walls are such a curse. Oh my gosh. We need an extra bedroom though. So. I might even give them a little bit more space in this parents room. Office? I mean, yeah, but. Oops. It's, it's very oddly shaped. That would be their door. That's the bathroom. The bathroom door could honestly be right there. Um. Yeesh. Okay, maybe this shouldn't be. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be a tough floor plan downstairs for sure. Okay, we need to fit two bedrooms, a kitchen, living room, dining room. That's fine. <laughs> we can fit all that. Everything's fine. <sighs> um, I do like the idea. I'm gonna do some like quick placement of rugs and stuff, uh, if that's okay. Because I do like the idea of, for example, this being, the, that's too small. This being the living room, I think is actually really nice. We could get like a stone fireplace too, which could be kind of cool. Um, match the outside a little bit or something. But I have a giant TV. Maybe this could be a dining room then. <gasps> what if that's a dining room instead? And then what if the living room goes here? 
I have an enormous TV. Okay, so hear me out. I might, I might kill this and make that a random corner of nothing, to be honest with you. Um, but imagine for a second, there's like a super cool living room space there. It won't be this furniture. <laughs> It'll be different furniture. I'm just placing stuff to fill it in. This could be a bathroom. There's enough space. And we could kind of sneak like a little door in the dining room a little bit so it's out of the way. Kitchen will be so far from the dining room. Yeah, that is a small problem. The kitchen will be really far away. Um, or I guess, do you know what? Maybe this could still be a bedroom with an ensuite. Does it fit a bed? It's tight. TV isn't centered. Yeah, but I mean, we could center it if you wanted, but I was just trying to make it a little bit more space. Um, if we could fit a double bed in here, that would be absolutely perfect. It's definitely tight with the end of the bed, but I think they can still work there. They can still like walk through it a little bit. Why don't you move the fireplace? Because I want to have a fireplace where the chimney is. I think that could be okay. The cats and dogs stone fireplace is skinnier. Oh, the brick one is? Oops. Oh, it is a little bit. We can maybe use that. It's a really long, skinny room, but it's, it's functional. That could be a bedroom. And then we could probably steal like that little part of the bathroom back if I wanted to. We'll just have that triangle be nothing. That's fine. Um, and then we can keep this as the living room. Um, this is like the hall bath for everyone to have access to. I don't know what this is. <laughs> I'm not sure what that is. <laughs> we have to think about that. Um, but maybe we could put like, I mean, we could have like the, that little hallway of my dreams down here. We could have like two more bedrooms and they can have a little hallway. And then this can be the kitchen dining area. They're really small rooms though. Um, but the kitchen and dining would be somehow over here. I don't think that's gonna work. There's not enough space for a kitchen. I need more wall space. Like I need to have the hallway be down here. Maybe I'll put it like this. Like that's a bathroom, that's a bedroom. And the hallway is in this weird small area. And then the kitchen goes like that with an island and then we can have a dining table. I feel like I may be able to make this work. And now it's a what, three, four bathroom, four bedroom house. This is the master bedroom in this situation, this room. 
We have a greenhouse. Okay. Let me put the kitchen in. Uh, I do have some stuff left over from the old one. Um, we have my fire ants. We have my trash can. <laughs> um, all the necessities, you know? We could also put an office if I wanted to. I mean, we could have this be the office if we so desired. But it's got like an ensuite bathroom, which is kind of nice. So what then, is this the bedroom, the main bedroom? I don't know. There's not a lot of space. More glass doors for the greenhouse entrance. Yeah, I'm gonna probably change the door. I need to think about it a little bit more. I wanna get the kitchen in first. Um, once I have the kitchen, I feel like I'll feel happy again. So <laughs> I wanna do that quickly. Yeah, we need like a beautiful, fancy kitchen because this Sim is gonna be a chef. So, no pressure. We have the fire toilet, don't worry. I, I did not forget the fire toilet. I did bring it with me. We can make the bathroom next to the master bedroom and office. I mean, it could be, but I wanna have an ensuite bathroom. Um, I feel like I would be more likely to have this be the the bedroom then. I don't know. It's not that nice. What is the fire toilet? Is it CC? Oh no, my dears. It's a toilet that is upgraded to have the, um, it's upgraded to have everything, <laughs> including uh, composting. And so if you don't use the compost, it spontaneously combusts. It catches fire randomly. Um, you might think that sounds horrible. And to which I would say, yeah. <laughs> It is. <laughs> but my, my toilet spontaneously combusts and it's very important to the, to the Let's Play. Um, it's actually kind of the highlight of the whole Let's Play. If we didn't have it anymore, the series would be ruined, so. Okay. We gotta get some cabinetry to like, split up the vibes in here. It's a bit tight, so. Lots of drawers, but hopefully not too many drawers. I don't think it's that bad. I think it's actually okay. And we can get a beautiful island. That's a bit tight with the sink. I don't know how I want to do this. Your new kitchen is all drawers? Yeah, that's pretty common. People are um, loving the drawers. I want the island to be centered with the... Uh... The tall cabinet is the same color. If you're seeing it as not being, it's just like the angle, the lighting is doing that. That's all, just weird lighting. Um, <sighs> a crescent island? That's true. That's not a bad idea. We have a, so much space for the dining room too. Like when we put the dining table in here, it's gonna be such an enormous amount of space. Um. If I size this down, that'll be okay, actually. Three tile island. Yeah, so you want me to just not have it centered. You want me to be having it like lined up with the edge. That's a nice amount of space. Is that okay? We'll put my magic trash can over here. 
If we did end pieces at the sides, it would have to be, um... Because I was using... Not an island counter. I was using, like, regular counters on this side. So we have to put, like... It's so big. What if we did round edges? And we had like a full on oval. I'm annoyed, I want it to be centered. Like it, it's, I find it really like, but if we center it with the stove, I guess if we made the kitchen bigger, but then the stove wouldn't be centered on the wall anymore, but that doesn't really matter. Such a large kitchen. <laughs> I feel like that's too big now. We could just have no end cabinet over there. I like that. I actually kind of like the island the way it is. The shape that it is is kind of cool. I feel like it's a really good size for a chef's kitchen as well, which is what we're going for. Like my sim is going to be a chef, so um, it's a it's a good large custom space, you know. Now the question is, what island do we want to do, or what um, bar stools? I mean. I wish that we had the green. I love the green, but I don't like the beige. Also, I might put some fake ones. They can't actually sit in these. They're not real. They're not actually slotted there. Maybe it's too much. I don't know. You want the big cabinet back? Really? What about, like... No. I liked the big cabinet too, but the space... This isn't a full size, um... Like, the cabinetry that we have wasn't full size. So we have to do something sneaky. Or should we put, like... Should we try and build it in like this? No? I don't know. What if we put... Is that weird? What if there was like shelves in there with it to tie it together? To fill in that empty space. It's kind of cool, it's kind of custom. We could put the coffee pot in that little nook. Did I bring my teapot or did I leave it? I left it, let's buy a new one, oops. Look, we could get like a little um, teapot of sorts. That's too tall, <laughs> let's put coffee. I kind of like it, it's actually cool. Okay. I need to have my fire ants. That's a necessity. We've brought those with us this whole time. Can't be getting rid of, getting rid of them now. So <laughs> we can't be losing our um, fire ants at this point, at, not at this stage. Oops, I want to get a big three wide window. That'll be lovely. How did you get the fire ants? Um, I collected them somewhere. I don't remember specifically. Okay. Sink in the island? Yeah, I'm gonna put the sink in the island. That was always the plan. I just hadn't done it yet because I was figuring out the rest of the layout, but the sink was gonna go there across from it. And I wanna get some cool like pendant lights above the island too. Um, lighting. 
Can I use two of these? If I use the medium wall height one, but sized it down. Oh, that's probably too low still. Dang it. Is there a room above this? Yeah, and you can see it in the floor. Boo. There's pretty pendants from other packs. Like we have like some pretty white ones and the seasons ones are lovely, but I might use those seasons ones. Oh, that is nice. That is nice. All lights. Okay. Beautiful. And we can get some like pretty, um, I don't know what sort of tile backsplash I would do. I feel like I might want it to be stone, but then again, do I really want to put stone like all over the place on the inside of the house? I don't know if I want to do stone. I don't know. Kimmy, me, Blue Lux, Coolie, Gabby, Princess, Evers, and Mice, and Jester, and Emily, and Astronomy, and Tori, and Dark Trainer. Thank you for those subs. I might put regular tile. Might want to get a tile tile. We could always do one like this. It's a nice touch. Sort of ties it in, but it's still tile, you know? Because I don't want it to be like all stone. Boo, stinky base game tile? Do you. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> oh, I don't know. I like, you're mean. <laughs> I don't know what to use instead. I mean, maybe like a brick. Oh, I put it on the staircase by accident. I think, yeah, I did. That might be nice, actually. That might work well. Yeah, I might do that. I don't think I want that to be there. I do want this to be like over here though. We're gonna need a pet bowl as well. Um, I need to think about it. I don't know what I want, so. <laughs> I don't know what I want it to look like. Um, I do think I want to put maybe like a small runner underneath there. I don't know. Column without the rock in the kitchen. Oh, we could use that one from upstairs. That could work better. I just want to like end it off, you know? Dishwasher? Maybe we could get a dishwasher. That would help it have less drawers too, which might be good. Okay. I'm gonna put some beautiful beams. Look at that. Lovely. Lovely. Um, we want to get some pretty plants and stuff too. We could even go for like really large plants. That's the thing. The space is huge. So we can get plants that are like appropriately huge to match. <laughs> um, that might be kind of fun. I actually like that a lot. That's kind of a cool one. I never use this plant. Should we use that? I think that's pretty. Okay. I think we're gonna need some curtains. Um, 
I don't know which ones. But I feel like some curtains would be nice. I don't know what color. Also, this is gonna be the greenhouse space. So we talked about putting like, I don't know if I should do this or not, but from Island Living, there's like the big sliding glass door. This matches the windows that I put. Um, should we put that into the greenhouse? I kind of feel like I should. It's nice because there's more windows in this area. That's actually a really cool view. I kind of like it. Okay. We can do, this is like a prime spot for a gallery wall as well of like my Sims photos and portraits. That'll be great. Um, this rug, what if we got something like that? That is a good spot for a gallery wall. Am I shadow banned? Nope. Frog kid, I can see you. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> I might use this cool glass table. Could be fun. Um. Oh, I don't know what I want to put. Maybe I'll use those chairs that Harry made. I do like those. I do think that is pretty. We'll have to get some bar stools that kind of match. I don't know about the bar stools. I'm really struggling to decide what I want it to be. We could also do no bar stools. I mean, we didn't bulldoze at all, Megan. I managed to do it without bulldozing. I thought I was gonna bulldoze like four times. I was fully prepared to, but then I didn't have to. You don't like the rug? Oh, <laughs> I liked the rug, okay. Um, we can think about a different one. Maybe the CC bar stools. Yeah, some plain wood ones might be better. Oops. Um, the plain wood ones might blend in easier. Yeah, that might be easier to use. You love the rug? Okay, so that was not the majority opinion, apparently. <laughs> okay. I might use like bright yellow flowers. Oh, pretty, okay. Those dining chairs are base game, um, but they were added, they did like a base game update where they added some custom content to the base game. Um, and that was one of the things for the, that those chairs and a matching table. Um, so change the curtains. Hey, and can I offer a piece of advice? Um, when people yell at me to change things, it is much more helpful when you propose an alternative instead of just yelling at me to change it. Um, so if you have any specific ideas, that would be super useful. Otherwise, um, please don't yell at me. <laughs> um, okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, Oro, I kind of miss uh, dissing the Maxis builds too, but I will say uh, them having Simmers build the lots has made the, the packs significantly improved, so. Um, that helps. Different color curtain. I don't know what curtains to use. Um, I'm not really attached to those curtains particularly. I just haven't decided yet. Um, I want to get some of the... Jungle Adventure has some really- I know I was gonna put a gallery wall on this, but I might put that there instead. Um, or maybe- well, wait, what if we got rid of the window and we put that there? And then I could keep my gallery wall. And we can get a really big plant in the corner, too. I like it. I think that's lovely. Um... Sorry. 
sorry. <laughs> Looks like the desert stuff we've been putting outside. We can put that in the in the uh, greenhouse. Change the color of the chairs to what? What do you think? Um, maybe I'll use this plant. That's a big one. Oh, maybe I should swap it so that this giant plant is in the corner because there's more space over here in the dining room. And then we could put this plant over here because there's a little bit less space here. Yeah, that's probably better. Okay. Um, yeah, if we could try and bring in some blue in the curtains, that would be great. I just don't know. I don't know which ones to use. And once we get some of the art up there, that'll be really helpful. Can I do lighter chairs? Yeah, maybe. Um, it doesn't really match the wood. Oh, we have a cat. The cat has arrived. We could do the white ones. I'm okay with the wood being a different color. Um, I do think I want to put something, I want, I'll maybe put the, pet, the pets bowl in this corner. We need a pet bowl before I forget, so let's put it down here. Um, I could use orange, that could be cute. Snap came to say hi. Hello, what's up? Island living curtains or the wedding pack? Maybe. I feel like I am kind of drawn to the same curtains over and over again. So using different ones might be a good thing, but. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Kitten carrier, uh, Zaw, and Naya, and Kala, thank you for the subs. Oh my goodness. What rooms have we done? Only these ones. <laughs> we haven't made that much progress. Um, it's taken me a while, so. Ah, oh, the window is so large. What if we did like some sort of lopsided curtains? Like what if there was um, like some, okay, some singular panels instead? Or if we tried to like, this annoys me because I don't like that um, the rod doesn't go all the way across. Like it sort of like really sincerely kind of bothers me about it. <laughs> um, but then you have more room to pick. There needs to be like a curtain rod item. Yeah, there is a, um, a sort of bluish gray swatch to these. That's like mint. They didn't like that one. I don't know. Is that good? No curtains, just wall art? Yeah, maybe. What wallpaper are we gonna use? Um. I feel like, I always use this one, but I love the, the stone on the floor. I think the stone trim at the bottom is so pretty. You like that mint curtain. Okay, well we can use the, the, the mint curtain. Um, I need to get something nice here. Yeah, it kind of ties in the stone from the outside. Exactly, it's kind of nice. Um, what about the dark blue swatch of this? You think the blue is better? I don't know if I like it. Oh, cat. <laughs> I don't know. 
We're gonna have a big gallery wall there with um, family photos. So that'll help fill in that space. The rug is from Cats and Dogs. Um, you think the gray pattern swatch on the curtains? I don't really wanna do that. I think it's a bit bright. Although I also think the mint is bright. I need to just revisit that. I'm sorry. I don't like it. I need to, I need to like come back to it later. <laughs> um, I think maybe I will do the bathrooms. So that I can revisit it because I'll feel better. There's a lot of bathrooms in this house. Sometimes it is good to just let your thoughts sit, you know? Embrace it. Save, okay. Uh, make her topaz face, dragon queen, bubba, Tyra. Uh, thank you for the subs. You don't know about this linoleum? It's not linoleum, it's tile. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna have this one just be a toilet and a sink, I think, um, in here. And then we'll hopefully have, I just have like so many bathrooms in this house, I'm trying to lessen it. Um, once we get these over with, I feel like we'll feel better about the progress as well. Window in the bathroom. I wasn't gonna put a window there because I didn't know um, how it would look from the outside. It might be okay. We can put some. I need to like swap the toilet and sink though. Okay. Um. I'm gonna put the fire toilet in a bigger bathroom. Um, I feel like I'll be more likely to use it if it's in a bigger bathroom than this one. I'm gonna put the fire toilet, like, for example, in, in this bathroom, maybe. Um, I think that'll be a good spot for it. Shall I put a picture of a family member in here? We can get a lovely photo of, do I have any dead cow plant photos? I know I do, is it a large one? Where is my family picture of the dead cow plant? Boo. Was it medium? It should be framed. I don't know. What about Stanley's grad photo? We could put up Stanley's graduation photo. That's an idea. Um, should I match the other toilets to the fire toilet? I mean, I can. I guess I probably shouldn't spend that much money on toilets anyway. So maybe I should. Um, the fire toilet is this one. So we can put that in there. I might give them like a cute shade or something. Do you have a picture of the fire toilet? You know what, maybe when we're um, almost done with the build, we can like try and get a picture of the fire toilet. <laughs> That'll be good. That'll show them. We'll go uh, get some pictures of the fire toilet and hang it up in the bathroom for some additional artwork, you know? I do the family pictures using um, the mosquito stuff. Uh, oh, why does it do that? The mosquito stuff um, tripod is super useful for that kind of thing. Okay, I'm really testing my own patience here with this, but I just want it to not clip. That's fine. Well, should I have like made it even sm Oh my God, I can't do this. Like actually what is wrong with me? 
No matter what I do, it's too big. I don't want this to cover the whole window. So what do I do? That's ugly. <sighs> Boo, I have to use different curtains. Oh, I do like this one. Would that one work? That could be okay. I'm sorry. I'm taking a very long time. It's a little bit embarrassing, but. I'll get it to fit, don't worry. There. <laughs> there. I have a curtain now. We also have a fire toilet. Um, soon to have a beautiful freestanding bathtub. I love it. And I'll put... Honestly, I'll get a shower. I'll put a shower in here. I like the concept. Um, and then I need to get a sink. Okay. This will be good. The amount of time and effort that we are putting into this is honestly probably a little bit too much. <laughs> but it's fine. It's worth it. That'll be good. Can you put a rug close to the fire toilet for no reason? <laughs> oh, you think I should put a rug in here to catch on fire? <sighs> what other good ideas do you have, chat? <laughs> what other suggestions do you have? No, I'm not gonna put a laundry basket. Um, that is one thing I, I veto that idea because I, I can't, I don't wanna do laundry in the Let's Play. It's too annoying. It's just too annoying. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I just can't. Um, <sighs> nowhere is good. I don't want to put the shower in that. It's like so weird and small. I'll put the toilet back there. Uh, this bathroom is too big. I might, I might kill this corner, to be honest with you. I prefer it without it. I know that's weird, but I'd rather it be smaller. Um. You can build a big shower, like a walk-in shower. I had that thought first, but I don't wanna do that because this shower is worse. Um, like this one is hygiene seven, reliability eight. You know, this one is like the cheapest one. Um, that's why I didn't do that. I also had that thought. That's why I built it like this. But then I was like, eh, I'd rather get a bigger one. Um, gameplay wise, I'd rather have a fancier shower. The snowy escape one's not very good either. Um, it is with good reason, I promise. <laughs> I'm not just doing it for no reason. <laughs> um, okay, hate this. Literally despise the game for this. So annoying. Why does it have to do that with the, the lighting? It is infuriating. It's fine, everything's fine. What if they have no shower? <laughs> Okay, we've drastically gone in a different direction. But what if they have no shower? That's a bad idea, is what that is. But I might do it. I might do it. Um, let me put this actually on. 
Maybe I won't put that. I don't know. I don't know what I want. I don't really care about the bathrooms. They're boring me. And that one looks, this plant looks ugly in here too. Why is the lighting like this? <sighs> table with towels near the tub. That could be cute. We could do, um, it's not a table, but it's that little stool from Jungle Adventure. I think this kind of thing is great for that. All right, fine, I'll re-download The Sims. I know, I, I have that effect on people. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Um, I believe that's clipping, but you know what, besties? I'm not gonna look. Here is the key to happiness. Don't check. <laughs> is it clipping? Not my problem. How often will you see it from that angle? Barely ever, so it's fine. Don't worry about it. Oh, beautiful. Stunning. Let me stick this over here. Okay, let's not spend too much in the bathroom for now. <laughs> um, I'm thinking that maybe we should make sure we furnish all the bathrooms just really quick. Make sure that we have them all done and then we can um, come back to that. <laughs> I hope you understand, but I, I just wanna make sure that they all are gonna function, you know? before we spend all of our money, because um, I have a problem with spending too much money. Um, we have to furnish the rest of the house still. So let's just not, we've got all the stuff, let's come back to it like once we've done some more, you know? No more bathroom decorations allowed. We gotta furnish the rest of the house first. Um, okay. Let's just get these little hallways done too, cause that's easy. Okay, maybe I'll put a little bookshelf in the little hallway. Always do that, but it's an easy filler. <laughs> when in doubt, place a bookshelf and then probably like a family photo or something. You know? Um. Are these the large ones? Ah, I got so many old pictures. Can we get one that's like a little bit more recent? Yeah, let's put Terry up. That'll be good. Okay, I like that. That was right before she died. Literally, I took that picture and then she died. <laughs> like seconds later. It was a picture of her in the sparkler and then she died. So. It's a good thing we took the photo because it was like instantaneous after I took that one. <laughs> Picture dead. So yeah, may she rest in peace. Okay, anyway, that's gonna be one of the kids' bedrooms. Um, I might do the, this bedroom first. This is gonna be, um, this is gonna be Pepper's bedroom. So I wanna try and get a little bit more color in here. Uh, Cause she had like a really fun bedroom before. I would like to use some wallpaper maybe. I don't know which one. I mean, we had fully had this wallpaper before, but I don't like how that looks on the diagonal cause it stretches it. Ugh, so annoying. Um, Maybe we could do one like this. We could do that like dark blue. That could be cool. And the stretching isn't as obvious with the florals on this one. It's a little bit like easier, I think. Maybe I could fit some curtains in here. I don't know if I like all those curtains. I kind of want them to be smaller. I do want a nice bed. I do want a nice bed. I don't know which one. We could use this one. Maybe I could scoot it back into the wall a little bit too. Yeah, it's a good thing these windows didn't get giant on the diagonal, I know. <laughs> we did get lucky there, actually. We did luck out. Um, can I try and like lighten up the space a little? 
I don't know what I want to do. <clears throat> I'm not sure. I haven't drank any water while this whole stream. Oh no. Or a four poster bed. You know, I liked the idea of that Tove, but I'm worried because it's so close to the fireplace. I'm not sure it'll fit. Um, let's try and get like a fun rug. Oh, why does it do this? We have to alt place it. It's the only way. No, I don't like that one. You hate this bed? Oh, do you? <laughs> this bed is from, um, from Seasons. You hate it? Do you hate this color more? Because I might use it. <laughs> do you hate this even worse? Because I might, I might do it. Um, no. That's too big. That's a better size. <sighs> Nothing fits. Don't like the pillows? I like the pillows because I'm trying to get some more color in here. So I like the pillows because they, they add an accent color that we did not previously have. And I think we need that. I think we need some more color. Um, no, I want to use a bigger one. Love the wallpaper, but not the bed. Interestingly, people really seem to dislike this bed. I don't understand why, because I have always really liked this bed ever since it first came out. I think you should, you think I should change the wallpaper? Oh geez, everyone's telling me different things. <laughs> They're like, change the wallpaper. No, change the bed. No, change the floor. No, I don't know. I'm just gonna do it the way I want to and then we'll figure it out, okay? I hope you understand, but at this rate, I don't know what to do because <laughs> everyone's telling me to do something different. Um, okay. How about the hairy rug? Also potentially, like a rug like that could be good, but maybe not in here. I don't know. The hairy rug, by that I mean the one from City Living. <laughs> um, we need some texture in here. Okay, I've sort of ruined it. Maybe it could be yellow. That's a nice hairy rug. Do you like it? I don't know if I like the, um, <laughs> I don't know if I like the color scheme, but, um, oh, maybe the peach, oh wait, that's better. It has like a little bit more of a peach, which might tie in better with the pillows. Yeah, I don't know if I like it, but we're gonna try it anyway. And we're gonna see if we can make it work. Color scheme is a bit unique, yeah. <laughs> you know, that's what I'm going for though, okay? We're trying to do something that is different than what we always build. So, let's embrace it. Lighter wallpaper, I wanna do the blue. Do you really think I should do something lighter? Isn't that like boring? Okay, that is bold. That is bold, but it maybe works. I kind of like it. Keep in mind, this Sim has like a, a full-on floral wallpaper in her bedroom right now. Well, I guess not anymore because I bulldozed it, but she had like full-on florals in her room. Uh, lots of orange and stuff. So this is kind of similar to her old bedroom. Okay. Okay. 
Um, we can get some like simpler lamps. And maybe I'll put like one chair in the corner. If we had like a peachy color, that would be fantastic. Something a little bit peachy. That's not peachy. That is peachy. Oh my God, that's perfect. Peachy color, little side table. Little beige side table. You think one of the floor tiles in this room is rotated? I think it's a glitch with a diagonal wall. Because it's all the same. I can't change it. I think I'm seeing it there and there. I think it's a glitch. And there. I think it's a glitch with the floors being run on a diagonal, which is very annoying. Um, I could cry. I won't lie, I, I could. Gonna try not to though. <laughs> Gonna try and be strong <laughs> I'm not cry. Oh, Sims, you and your glitches. Thank you so much. Seriously, wow. Okay, I kind of like it in here. It's kind of cool. We'll get a wide mirror. And maybe they could have like, I don't know what to put above their bed. <laughs> Honestly, I don't know, but maybe, Don't love the rug, more color. Do you think it needs to be brighter? That is horrendous. Absolutely horrendous. I guess this one comes in a kind of peachier color. Oh no! which maybe fills up the room better. It's very similar to the color of the, you like the hairy rug. Okay, we want the hairy rug back. I'm sorry, they like the hairy rug. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> the chat insists upon the hairy rug. Nothing can be done. Hairy rug it is. Okay. Um, I don't know about this room. In fact, I actually think it's a little bit ugly. To be perfectly honest with you. <laughs> I really and truly actually think it's a little bit ugly. Um, and yet, here we are. Little candles on the mantle. Oh, that could be cute. Of course they don't slot to the mantle because why would they? That would just be too easy. Come on. Different fireplace. We couldn't fit any of the other ones. They were, um, I can show you, but the other ones were like a little bit too close to the bed. Um, we started with this one. I don't know. I might be okay using it again, but. Maybe it's not even that much bigger. It might be the same. <laughs> I think this bed is just smaller than the other ones we were testing. So I think it fits better. Let's use that one, because that matches the stone outside better. Okay. I need to, um, <laughs> I need to think about that. 
Okay, this is gonna be grandma's room. Uh, this one down here will be grandma's room before she dies. Oh, she already is dead. Oh, shoot. Okay, so this is Anna and Blake's rooms. Blake's not dead yet, but Anna is. <laughs> They're, they still live here. Um, they do still live here. And, and, uh, they're not both dead yet. Anna is dead, but she's a ghost, so she's still around. Blake is an elder. Uh, I might try and get something that was kind of similar to their original. They had, like, some dream home decorator vibes going on. They had a really pretty bed, so I might steal it and put it back. Um... Love the dusty color. Maybe I'll try and do something like that. If we put the... It's kind of like a gray all over the walls. Maybe we could put... I don't know. I don't know. I need to think. We have the fire toilet. Don't worry. It's right here. That's the fire toilet. So we do have that. Cats and dogs quilt bed. Oh, that could be cute. Oh, maybe I'll use that instead. Is that like out of the ordinary for them? Do you think that would be weird or would they like it? If we tried to get some green, maybe, with this? Um, or if we tried to do, like... It's too grandma-y. I think it might be too grandma-y. If we used one of the plain beds, like, if we did this... Um, this is, like... Grandma E, but like in a trendy way. You know? Which is maybe what we need. Trendy grandma. Is there any cute patterned rugs we could fit in? I would like that. Does that match any of the... That actually kind of works. Obviously the wallpaper doesn't work. The wallpaper needs to be different, but I think that actually fits together. You know? Ghost wallpaper is an idea. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Um, this rug is from Get Famous. This is a Get Famous rug. It's growing on me. Um, I'm probably gonna put, like, a big dresser. Something, honestly, we could use, like, a big one. Big, big one. And then... Maybe scoot it over a little so we can have a large plant with it. Oh, I guess Anna needs a computer. And we don't really have an office. So, oopsies. This dresser could fit kind of there. Not really, but kind of. Six bathrooms, zero offices. It's not six, it's four. It's four bathrooms. I also hate this room still. Oh God. It's the rug. I think the rug needs to be darker. I need to think about it. Um, I'm gonna put a desk right here. Okay, I think any sort of desk will do. Might scoot it into the wall. Eh, nah, ugly. Hey, Snap, what's up? Um, maybe like a plain one? Oh, God. 
This one is smaller. Comes in a sort of right color. Okay, we have a computer already. We do have a nice computer, so that helps. Um, we can definitely put a desk in the, I guess we can put a desk in this area. This could be like a little office nook. We could try and like embrace it, you know? Oh, that could be actually kind of cute. Maybe that's better. Okay, so never mind. I can go back to how I had it previously. And I can use the desk in the hallway. This build is gonna take me so much longer than I thought it would. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> this is a disaster. Okay, um, I'll place a couple extra windows in here. Any additional windows are, in my opinion, a plus, you know? You did say five hours? Yeah, I did. I don't know if I'll stream all of it today. I'm not sure. Freckles, that's so Costa and Viso and Afton and Haley. Thank you for the subs. It's almost 1 a.m. for you. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> terrible. That's terrible. Maybe I'll flip it so that the bed is on this wall. Ooh, I like that better. It's kind of in like a little nook, you know? Um. Oh my gosh, concept. What if they had doors to the outside? And then we could give them like a little private patio space. We could kind of put like a small bit of a fence just in the front so it's not as obvious. And they could have like a little teeny sneaky private patio. Oh, this could be so cute. Blake can do their knitting out here. We'll put like some, some trees and stuff to sort of like hide it away. I like this little concept. I think this is actually really cute. It's fun because we're sort of trying to make like a space for the grandparents that's private as well. So it's nice to have like some little extra areas. I don't know. I feel like it just is gonna fit together well. Is that ugly? I think it's ugly. We can put some rocking chairs or something. I don't know, it's gonna be cute. <laughs> um, Maybe I'll put the plant like that. And we could do like a couple other cactus like that. And then maybe a rock. Where's Peter gonna go? Um, I'm gonna sh have some kids share a room for now and then we're gonna move Peter out anyway. So Peter will be gone relatively soon. Okay, I'm gonna get a rocking chair. No, yes, rocking chair. I'm sorry, my chat, I'm, I'm, <laughs> sometimes I don't know what's going on in my own stream chat. <laughs> I feel like this is one of those times. I don't know what you're all up to, but it can't be good. <laughs> okay, I need to get some lighting. We don't have any outdoor lighting yet, so that's my bad. Where's the little cheap one, this one? All right, do I like those? I said woohoo bush, Dika said woohoo cactus, here we are, mm-hmm, right. So, <laughs> besties, I don't know if I can get behind that. We can't just do stuff like this small sliding glass door. We could put a sliding glass door. I mean, I'm not opposed to doing that. It would be really nice from the room as well. Maybe let's do that. I like that better anyway. Okay, that's good. And then we can try and get some cute blue lamps. 
Maybe there could be like a mirror on the wall right here. And brown or something. That seems like a good room for them. Maybe I should fill uh, the little fence all the way to the edge. Yeah, what a great little patio space. I love how big the windows are too. I think that's a really nice touch. Will the money be enough? Um, I think so. We only have to furnish a couple more rooms. I think we should be okay for money. I like, honestly, I actually think we're gonna be okay. Um, I'm gonna put one light in here where it's not overhanging anything. All right, and then we gotta get some garden planters in this little greenhouse. Um, I might do like we did in the old greenhouse in the Potts family. We had like two in the middle and then I might get some various ones around the side. I might not fill it as much like, I might not have it be completely full. I think that could be good. Okay. Um, maybe a glass door to the outside. Oh, I guess. No, I don't like how they fit. <laughs> uh, I don't like how they fit, so I don't want to. I'm sorry. I used to have like all these beautiful fairy lights outside and they're all gone now because I killed them. So what if we did some more? like along the back of this. Oh, it's so close to being the right size. It is so close to being the right size. What if I just made it smaller? And we could have a place to get out of the backyard from here. Okay. I actually kind of like that. Um, let's get some toddler stuff again. I need a little pole. How do I want to do this? I was wondering if maybe I should put like, um, or maybe, hang on, let me think about this again. It's a little bit tighter. It's a little bit odd but maybe if we did it like this would this fit better I think that is better okay we can put this back now it was weird. I don't know why I did that. I'm sorry. It's way better like this. <laughs> way better like this. Okay. And then I guess we could probably just do something similar to these. How we just had them like in there a little, you know? Why are the tiny pots asymmetrical? Um, I think it's gonna look cute once there's stuff planted in there, Dana. My thought process is that they're being moved around, probably. Um, okay, I do want to have some grass. I'm so sorry, but I really want to have grass. <laughs> I think it's sad, and I kind of want to have some grass. Although, I may even um, make the yard smaller. This is weird, okay? But hear me out. 
what if we did something like this? Just open this all up to the back. Um, I want to have like, that's fine. Um, and then I can put my little pond in like a secret grotto back here. Cause I have this pond we need to find a spot for. And I'm not really sure where to put it. So if we made like a secret grotto in the back. I think that could be okay. I like it. I'll put my little graves next to it again. Over here, maybe. <laughs> there we go. The Sims should be able to get underneath those lights. Yeah, it should be fine. And I can put my little chickens back here. I spelled chicken wrong. I can put my little chickens back here. Um, this might actually be a cute little spot for them. And then... Yeah, so I guess we could do... The grass could be terrain paint for the chickens. Okay. Oh, that's the wrong thing. Oops, that's the wrong thing again. We'll have to get... Hopefully... Nice and simple little grass. Mm. Sorry. Messing with bees too? Um, I hadn't really thought about using bees. I'm, I'm trying to think if I'm gonna be able to do all of those things. Bees and chickens and my crops. And the answer is, I'm not sure. <laughs> so, we'll have to see. Uh, I haven't fully decided that yet. It might be cute to get a couple, though. Okay, we'll get... This is gonna be more so for, like, my giant crops. Maybe I'll just do two rows of them. And then I can get a swing set. That's actually important to me. Swing set back here. Maybe some bees. Maybe some worms. What's the bug box called? <sighs> this thing. Insect is the word I'm looking for. We could put some bees and an insect farm. We can paint them cute. I don't know. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna regret this. <laughs> I don't know, we'll see. Um, I just put my dead cow plants up here too. Um, I need a spot for, well I have one dead cow plant I should say. Ew! Okay, this is ugly because it's winter, but it's gonna be prettier once it's not winter, okay? <laughs> That's really ruining the vibes, I won't lie. <laughs> Can they die from bee stings? You know, I'm not actually sure about that. Um, I don't think so. I don't think so. I think they just get uncomfortable. That seems the most likely to me, but... All right, the grass terrain paint looks really ugly too. It's because it's winter. It's all very sad and disgusting. All right, um, that'll hopefully be better when it's not winter. <laughs> I'm hoping that it'll, it'll be improved when it's no longer winter time. I do love the outside of this house though. I think it turned out really nice. 
Um, I guess... Maybe I'll put a little bit of dirt underneath the chickens too. Okay. We should keep furnishing the inside though because I'm gonna be very sad if we run out of money and we haven't finished. So one of my brothers that still lives here is a painter. Um, he's gonna move out soon, but we can decorate the room for him. He had in our old house like a kind of fun, oh God, sorry, you don't get an expensive one anymore. Um, he had a kind of fun pink room, so I know, I'm gonna put pool stuff out there, don't worry. I just wanna make sure I furnish the house first. I know it's kind of a weird order because I was working on the outside a second ago, but um, like I said, I wanna make sure I furnish the house before we uh, spend all of our money on the exterior. <laughs> so we'll come back to that once we've done a little bit more. I'm sorry, I just wanna make sure we get this done. It would be very upsetting if we didn't have it all finished, so. Let's use this reddish brown stuff. This could be cool. Um, I have less space than I thought I did. And like I said, he's gonna move out. So I'm not that worried about him, <laughs> but um, we wanna make sure he's at least got a room for now. And the other kids, his siblings can um, share a room, I guess. Maybe we could get a plant in the corner there. No, it's not the green and brown swatch. That's that I believe is the white swatch. It's just the lighting is weird. This is the brother that died but then came back to life. Yeah. <laughs> Tessa, Tella, Dimples, Ryder, Freckles. Esto and Fizo and Acosta and, um, and Pod and Haley and Alexis, thank you for the subs and Afton, thank you for those gifted subs too. Um, won't the bug box present, prevent fire toilet? Oh my god, you're right, never mind, no bug box. I need the fire toilet, that's the most important part. I don't care about the bugs, I, I need the fire toilet. <laughs> um, the fire toilet is the most important part. Hands down, without a doubt, the most important part. Um, what does the fire toilet do? It spontaneously combusts. Um, <laughs> not kidding, actually. <laughs> I'm dead serious. We have bees, there's still bees out there, don't worry, I didn't get rid of the bees. Um, there are still bees out there. I just got rid of the bug box. Um, you know what? Let's call that room a day for now. This is gonna be the shared room between the other two teens. I feel a bit guilty about this, I won't lie, because they had their own rooms before, and now I'm sticking them in a shared room. I made a smaller house, <laughs> but um, they're gonna share one, at least until, um, once his face moves out, so. Maybe we could do like bunk beds or something. I won't lie, I would hate that. If I was like 17, there is nothing I would want less than to share bunk beds with my little sister. So maybe I won't do that to them. <laughs> Cause I would literally hate that <laughs> when I was younger. Um. I don't know if I want to make them do that. Why don't the stairs match the railing? I haven't changed the color of them yet. Um, is that better? All right, we're gonna get some family photos on this wall, I think, um, eventually. So we'll have that to go for us. Um, I want to, I don't want to do them yet. I'm not sure what I want to do. Maybe this could be cool in here. Hmm. 
Hmm. What is the legacy house new to Sim Streams? This is the house for a family that I'm playing with for 10 generations. I'm not on 10 generations yet, um, but I've been playing with this family for a long time. When people say legacy, they mean like a legacy challenge. Um, and in a legacy challenge, you play with the same family for 10 generations. So uh, you can see I'm on seven uh, that we've been playing through, but this is what we're talking about when we say legacy house. So we're starting a new generation. Pepper is gonna be the new heir. So we're decorating for her. Okay. What sort of wallpaper shall I give them? I want to do something that is maybe a little bit more fun. And I'm kind of leaning towards like, what if we gave them leaves? If they have to share a room. No, I don't know if I like that. Never mind. I want to do like something fun though. What about just like this one? But if we got it in like a, we could do like an ocean theme. <laughs> we could do an ocean theme in our room in the desert. You know what? That actually really amuses me. I'm, I've decided that's what I want to do. I'm going for ocean theme in the desert. Thank you for listening. That is definitely my plan. Okay. Fantastic. We can use the same bed. But I might have them have like their own sort of separate corners to the room. Under the sea. <laughs> These kids are teenagers um, as well. And they're now sharing an under the sea themed bedroom. I think they'll like it. Parenthood. Well, maybe I could split it so that they have like a similar color scheme, but a slightly different, um, maybe I'll put it on this wall. Similar color scheme, but slightly different beds. You know, that could be kind of cute. Didn't he get like Child of the Islands? Isn't that the trait that he got? Oh, no. Who did? Maybe that was my other legacy. I randomized the traits, so I don't remember. Um, <laughs> I don't know why I thought that, because apparently he didn't have that trait, but. <laughs> I want to put a desk in here, too. Um, they can sort of share one. Do a divider, maybe, in between? I don't know if I want to do that or not. Um, I like the idea, but I also kind of want them to... I don't know. Maybe I did want that window back. Yikes. We might need it. <laughs> the room's kind of sad. <laughs> Ugh, I don't know about this. I don't know if it, the room is big enough. Exactly, the room is kind of small. I don't know if like the divider is, um the best use of the space. Cause I, I feel like that's gonna sort of shrink the livable space that we have left, you know? Um, I wanna try and bring in some like, other colors with the rug. Maybe the orange and blue could help. If we had like some more orange on the walls too, maybe we could like tie it together better like that because it's too much blue right now. So if we found like some orange art, that might help. Um. The chef poster is kind of funny, especially because their sister is gonna be a chef. We could do something like that. And then like these, this is kind of cute art. 
So maybe... I don't know. I can definitely use that there though. How much was that? 460, okay, that's fine. Um, this little fox thing could be good. Maybe a calendar too. Why? Give me the thing from Cats and Dogs. For teens? Yeah, this is a teens room. Do you think this is weird for a teens room? <laughs> I don't. I think people get in their heads that teens are a lot older. Teens can be like 13, you know. I know that the Sims ones are maybe more like 15, 16, but like you could still have some childish things in your room. Um, you don't need to grow up and, and throw out all of the cutesy things that you had. <laughs> like, it's okay, you know? Um, it's not like a, a switch flips one day and you gotta get rid of all your stuff. Okay. Um. I don't know. Maybe like, I'm trying to see what would be a cute, maybe honestly just doing this would be a nice little touch. Maybe we could put the mirror there. Okay. And then we can try and get some more orange. Is there like orange mirrors maybe? I don't know. This room's probably gonna get changed, like, <laughs> relatively soon as well. I, I will warn you. Oh my god. It's like the sun or something. <laughs> Jeez. This room's gonna get changed probably, like, pretty soon. Um, just because as soon as their brother moves out, I'm gonna have them each have their own rooms. So, they probably won't be sharing this space for, like, that long. I think that's probably something to keep in mind. Um, so we don't need to put, like, too, too much effort into it. Because it's probably gonna change. Um. Aww, this is kinda cute! Maybe they can each have, like, a different table lamp. And maybe I'll give them a little fish bowl. Maybe you could have, um, that one. And then, or we could do it. no, lava lamp, lava lamp, lava lamp. Let's do like the yellow one. And then you could have the sports lamp. If there's one thing I love, it's this lamp. <laughs> okay, maybe we could get like a backpack and then, like I said, the fish bowl. For the record, we don't condone putting fish in bowls. Don't do that in real life, it's not good for them. However, it's The Sims, and you don't even have to feed fish in The Sims, cause they're fake, so <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> um, that's all good. Oh, I might get like a little fake hamper actually. That could be cute. I don't wanna use a real one cause I don't want laundry, but we could do a fake one. They are fake just like Sims babies, oh my gosh. <laughs> There you go. Perfect. Makes perfect sense. Okay. Clothes. Um, we want like a little lamp. Maybe I'll do the black one. That'll be okay for them. Oh, I wanted a backpack. Shoot. If you search backpack, there we go. Grim, that one. All right, that will do. I like those bedrooms, it's actually very cute. Um, what else can we add in? Let's try into the living room. We also have loads and loads of photos and I still have these giant bookcases that I never put anywhere as well. Um, 
I don't necessarily have to use them, but if we so desired, we could put them somewhere. Ooh, that could be cool in the living room, maybe? They're pretty expensive, so it might be fun to use them. Same thing with like this. Um, I don't have to use this, but I think it's funny. It's like a stolen piece of jewelry from when my sim was in the criminal career. And that really amuses me about it. So I kind of want to put it in, you know? <laughs> um, it's odd. It makes very little sense. I'm gonna put my baseball bat in here. That's also from my days as a criminal. But I like it, so I'm gonna keep it, you know? Thanks for understanding, everyone. Maybe a dog bed? Yeah, um, we have a cat right now. A little small one named Cookie. So maybe I'll put a, um, cat tree or something. We won't forget our gallery walls, don't worry. The art that I want to put on the walls is like my favorite part of the whole thing, so. And by art, I guess I don't, it's not really art, it's more, um, photos of my sims, but. <laughs> uh, that's like one of my favorite parts of the whole decorating process, so don't worry, I won't forget. Well, Sriracha, thank you for the gifted subs, and Hungry, and Snarty, and Jaden, and, and Nay, and Kring, and, and Blaze, and Lena, and Shark. Thank you so much, everybody. Oh my goodness. Cats also like beds. Yeah, a little tiny one would be cute, but I just, I'm thinking that the cat tree might be more fun. Because in my head, I was picturing we put like a giant dog bed, and then I was like, wait, I don't have a dog, so the cat tree would fill up more space. And the cat tree is like a bed, but it's also a tree. <laughs> so... It serves both purposes, you know? We need a litter box too, oh my goodness. That could have been bad. Um, let me get that before I forget. I can put that in here. There. This is the living room, it's gonna be in this area um, once we get through with it. Okay, hopefully a little bit more wallpaper in here. I guess I could just shift click. I don't know why it wasn't. Um, should I put a wall? I might like how it looks better if I put a wall. How much I usually plan a bill before I start? You know, you know that's a good question. It kind of depends. Um, like, with this build, I actually planned a lot before I started. I, um, have over the last few days been looking at a lot of inspiration photos to try and figure out what I wanted to build. But this one is, like, a little bit more high stakes than most of my builds because I'm playing in it, like, in my YouTube series. Um, so I, I planned this one a lot more than I might normally plan a build. Sometimes I just, like, stream and I'm like, I want to build something, I don't know what yet, we'll figure it out. And then I kind of just wing it. So it sort of depends, but I guess the builds that I play in, I think I usually tend to plan a little bit more. Um, the ones that I just build for fun, I don't so much. I think that makes sense though. Um, I might put a stone accent behind that desk actually. I think that could be kind of cute. I don't know. Unused corner should be a cat nook. This little spot, I was just gonna make it empty. I was just gonna leave it empty. We do have a pet bowl. I did get a pet bowl, don't worry. I didn't forget that. Um, I want a big rug. Do we have any fun, like, square ones that could be good? This would fill up the space nicely. The bathroom does have wallpaper. It's kind of a beige color though, so it might not be super obvious. <laughs> um, 
you had the impression I didn't plan this one at all? Well, I, well, what do you mean by, like, didn't plan at all? Because I, I did, I, like, had an idea of the sort of style of build I wanted to do, but I didn't, like, practice building it first, you know? Like, I just winged it and was gonna... But I, I had reference photos for it, but it wasn't that I didn't plan it, you know? Like, I, I came in with an idea of what I wanted to build, and then, um, thought that we would sort of round out that idea together, but, um, that's kind of how I usually go about it. We could use a cool coffee table, maybe one of these. That might be a fun thing to do. I kind of like the room being on a diagonal like that too. I think it actually looks quite cool. We have a lot of open space in this area, which is kind of, um, I don't know. That table is from Jungle Adventure. There's a lot of cute furniture from Jungle Adventure. We can look at some more of it. Um, Jungle Adventure. See if we want to throw anything else in here. Maybe I could use... That's a little bit bright. I don't think I want to do that. I like the coffee table though. I think it looks good. What should we put in this corner? You know, my Sim is supposed to like music. Should we put a piano? She had a little teeny piano in her bedroom. What if she had like a big one? That could be fun. I think I like that. Okay. Let's get... Stop. Could probably make that green. Um, Nat, I'm not sure how long I'm gonna stream tonight. I'm gonna work on the bill a little bit longer though. Kashi, Chuckles, uh, Faith and Cooper, thank you for the subs. Oh, thermostat. Oh my gosh, we really need a thermostat. Um, let's put it down here. This could be a good wall for it. We'll definitely put a chess table outside, I think. I'm not really sure where. Um, and we also talked about wanting a cat tree. I don't know if I still do. But it would be fun. I feel like they're, they're just so ugly, you know? That's the real problem with them, is they're all kind of ugly. <laughs> but that's true in real life, too, and I still have them in real life, so why should let it stop me? I think that could be cute right there. And we could put a little plant next to it or something, you know, we'll, we'll use it. Cookie deserves the world. Do you know what, Royal, you asking me that? Uh, they asked if I want to get more pets after uh, my house is done being renovated. And the answer is like, maybe, probably. Do you know what my new thing is? So my sister has a bearded dragon. She's had him for like four years. I don't know. She's had him for a while. Um, he's not like a new pet, but I have always liked this little guy. But recently, oh, he's so cool. I love him so much, but like, I, oh, he has to eat live bugs. And I don't know if I can do that. Like, I don't know if I can, but he's so cool. I love him. I love him so much. He's like the best little guy, but he has to eat live bugs. And I don't know if I can do that. That's the problem. You know, can Dan feed him? I, well, I have to, if I'm gonna get a pet, I wanna do it myself. I fed my sister's bearded dragon before, like I've taken care of him, but do I wanna have to do that on a regular basis? I don't know, but anyway, he's really cool. I really like him, but yeah, they also eat like worms and vegetables and stuff, but they, they do need to have like live crickets and worms as part of their diet. That's like a necessity. Um, and that, I hate to say it, but I'm sorry, that's, that's nasty. 
Worms? They eat worms? Careful, Snap! Oh no! <laughs> Snap, stay away! I heard they eat worms! <laughs> I call my cat Wormy, that's the joke. Um, that's my cat's nickname. Don't worry, I'm not concerned about the lizard eating the cat. Oh, Christine, I bet she was. I bet um, her seeing the lizards in Florida would have been really fun. Um, but anyway, long story short, I really like him. My sister's bearded dragon is so cool. I'll probably put some photos on that wall. I need to get a um, desk chair still. Anyway, I think maybe if I use the same chair from the dining room, the lizard's name is Nova. I think it's a cute one. Yeah, maybe I'll use that. That could work. Anyway, <laughs> I'm a big fan of lizards, so. That's my life update for you. Don't tell my sister I said that though. Sometimes I text her and I'm like, give me lizard video. <laughs> and then I'll just respond more. <laughs> give me lizard video. I might ask her right now. Give me lizard video. <laughs> I don't know if she's home. Give me lizard video. Okay, um, I want to get a <laughs> straight to the point. No hi, just give me lizard video. <laughs> Fiddle dragon, Anna, thank you for the subs. Okay. What else? I need to put some lights on the patios and then I need to finish the like dining space. I haven't really done that yet. Um, let's see. I want, let me put one of those. Same thing out here. Okay. I like this living room a lot, actually. I think it's kind of cute. I might get like a little ottoman or like a little bench or something underneath the window. I'm just looking at that and thinking that it might be nice to have like a little something else right there. Oh yeah, that's good. That helps. Okay. Um, we have to work on this more. And then I wanna get some outdoor stuff. I wanna put like some lounge chairs out here. We can put an umbrella holder by the door cause you know it rains so much in the desert. It'd be great to have an umbrella holder. <laughs> I might put an umbrella out here actually, speaking of which. Um. Fire pit? Oh, that could be so- wait a minute. You might be onto something. Hang on. What if we put these, like, right here? So they're not super in the way. Can they be a different color? Maybe I'll do the darker ones. And then what if there was, like, a fire pit on this side of the- Oh, we're gonna need a bar, too, for the chef career. Ooh, I didn't really think about that. I want a fire pit. <laughs> I got excited about my fire pit. Wouldn't that be so cool? It'll be on the gallery, yeah, don't worry. I'll stick it on the gallery when it's done. Um, I promise. I'm probably gonna, the reason I haven't put any of my photos on the wall yet, I'll, I, I did put one. Um, I'm gonna finish the build and then upload it to the gallery and then do my photos on the walls. So that way uh, the photos don't ruin your version of the gallery build. Um, so that it doesn't like say it includes CC or anything. That was my plan. Uh, let's get some lights for the pool too. Maybe one over there. One over here. How high did I put it? One there. One there. That could be good. 
Um, and then... I mean, I guess we could do a bar... instead of a patio table? What if we got like a cool built-in one? Um, and we tried to make it bigger so it looks better. Hello, that's my cat clawing on her cat tree. Um, maybe if we put, like, can I help you, Snap? What you up to? Okay. Keep it going. We could do, like, three. Could I add a grill? Yeah, I wanted to, but I don't know where to put it. What if we had this down here instead? And then, okay, what if the bar was smaller? We had it just like that, okay? So it's a little bit less close to this. And then we did like the patio table over here and a little grill, like right here. Table there. Doesn't look like an outdoor bar to you, you don't think? Okay. <laughs> um, I'm gonna put some seating out here though. I think that'll be good. Some sort of table. And then we can put, maybe they want me to use like, I don't know, the stone one? We could use this one from Perfect Patio. I don't like the colors. The colors are ugly, a little. I'm not sure about that. Um, the walls on the back patio are different on- Oh, that's because my- I had to replace them. Thank you for telling me, because I didn't notice. I think I like it. I think it looks good like that. It's growing on me. I think it's okay. Um, I don't like these chairs, though. Your issues with the way it meets with the planter. We could probably scoot it over a little. So it's like better lined up. We're running out of money, so we gotta be careful. <laughs> We're spending all of our money. Um, we gotta tone it down a little bit. Maybe I could use like the perfect patio. Um, like this table. I think I like that better. You know, I think that's a nice touch. Does it come in like, we all use the stripey one, or we could always use the, we could use the black version. I think that's nice. I think that fills in the patio space nicely. It's not like too odd. We can just get like a little bit of extra landscaping, save the game, trash can, stuff like that. Um, and then we can finish the kitchen and then it's pretty much done, I think, which is good. I'll just put the trash can out here. It's out of the way. Um, Front yard is pretty much done, I think. I don't know what else we could add to the front yard. 
Um, inside, it's like decorations I want to get for the most part, like. Um, we can put some more fireflies outside too. We do have a mailbox. I did get a mailbox already. Why does that not sit in the center? Oh, geez. This game. Okay. <laughs> uh, this is the mailbox. So we do have a mailbox, luckily. Um, I want to do a big gallery wall on that wall, I think, with family photos. I need to get some more kitchen stuff. I haven't put like any decorations in the kitchen yet. Yeah, the way nothing slots properly, isn't that like so infuriating? <laughs> you try and slot stuff and the game's like, mm, no. Oh, you wanted to slot it? Mm, no. Oh, I didn't get my chess table. I said I was gonna put a chess table somewhere. We don't have one. We don't actually need one. I know, horrifying. Who thought Lil Simsy would ever say that? But, <gasps> Kayla, hey, thank you for the raid. Welcome in. Oh my gosh, can I show you my build? I'm actually obsessed with this. This is my new legacy house for my YouTube uh, Let's Play. I am obsessed with this. I think it turned out so cool. We're just putting some like finishing touches on the inside still. We're adding like all kinds of little details. I meant to put these fireflies in the backyard, hang on. Um, we're just gonna, well, I guess we have a bunch over here. Maybe I'll put some over here. I'm just putting a bunch of like little finishing details on the house, but I hope you had a good stream. Uh, can we get a caster for my friend, Candidly Kayla? Besties, if you don't follow Kayla, you are so missing out. Listen, here's my theory. You already like one Kayla, so why not like two? Um, there's a link in the chat, please go follow her. <laughs> also Fluffy and, and Strange of the Subs, Kayla with the 16 months, Smith and Drew and Stardy and Magically and Fiddle and Dragon, thank you for the subs too. Um, anyway, we've been working on this house a little bit, so I'm trying to do some like last minute details. I have some more decorations from my inventory that I haven't put out yet. Like I have this dragon and I have that little statue. I have this sneaky bag of money. I actually have two bags of money. I might put that one in here. Um, I have this little octopus. Oh, I used to have a cow plant in my kitchen. That's right. I have to keep that. Oh, my dead cow plant! That belongs outside. See? Oh, it's a good thing I was thinking about my stuff because I would have forgotten some of these things. I built this house today, yeah. <laughs> the entire thing. <laughs> um, we did this all today. Mm -hmm. I don't know how to do this. I do want more bees. Where should I put my dead cow plant? Oh, you know what? It actually looks kind of good, like, in the landscaping. I like that. Just all my stuff, I can put some of my things in here too. So we should put some of my little like decor objects in the shelf. Take advantage of it while you can. I like that. Why does that place on top? Why, why do you think I want it up there? Literally, why would I want it up there? Absolute nonsense. Okay, I do want this tragic clown though. He belongs down there, so. Okay. <laughs> um, I don't think I want that rose. I did have some really ugly paintings that my Sim made. Uh, I've had these for ages. I might post them in a sort of prime position here. There's something about this one that just really gets me. <laughs> I don't know what it is. It just really, it gets to me. I, I think it's a masterpiece personally, so I'm gonna keep it. Uh, I also might get, how about those little magazines from Parenthood? I think that could be good. Let me stick like, Hello, Parenthood Magazines. It's like a little, what am I looking for? This, it was right in front of my eyes. I might put that right here. Don't like that color, okay. 
I think that's pretty good. Um, should I get all eight chairs? Maybe I will use all eight chairs. That's gonna be a gallery wall of photos of my Sims. Um, other things we have, do I care about that? Not really. I like this little thing. I could put it in the bathroom maybe. Okay. I wasn't done with the kitchen. <laughs> I'm getting so distracted. <laughs> okay, I want paper towels. I did put a bunch of fireflies outside, so we did do that, which is good. Um, we don't have our chess table yet, and I haven't put my cube back yet either. I actually should put that down. I should just put the cube like on the living room table. Um, maybe if I had like a little, wait, is there already a clock in here? Oh, there is one right there. Never mind. No chess table? Who are you? Okay, I'll try and find a spot for one. What if we put one like here? In the front. Is that too close to the, does that like ruin the walkway? Or is it? Mm, that's okay. It's not my favorite, but it's okay. Maybe to the left? We could put it like, I don't need it. I don't need it. We don't need it. We're being bold and brave this time and we're not putting a chess table. Um, what else? Maybe like a set of bookshelves to go right. I'm just, I want something taller like right here. Are there any good colors of them or are they all kind of weird? Mm. This might work. Where am I gonna hide the trash can? <laughs> Maybe I will put it there. We have the cabinet right here already. So we do have that. Um, all right, we have to finish putting, I might stick my little fire ants back there in the corner so your Sims don't try and cook there. And then I'll just get a couple more like decor items um, right here on this little shelf. Yes. Okay. Oops. The reason that wall is blank, by the way, the wall um, over here is because I'm gonna put family photos on it, so I haven't done it yet. Uh, maybe I will put the clock over here. That could be nice. The get together tea box shelf around the coffee machine. Yeah, we could put the little, hang on, let me get that. Packs get together. I can try and sneak it back there behind it. Is that in the wall? I'm sorry, I'm like leaning so far forward so I can see. All right, that could be good. Um, what else? Is there any cute little like wall decorations we could put? Things that we never use. Let me look at the base game stuff. Well, we could put like this. Maybe a fork. <laughs> I kind of like it. <laughs> I kind of like it. Maybe I'll keep it like that. I might put like some little flowers back here closer to the pot. Can I alt place that a little bit better? Come here. Let me just, let me just sneak you a little bit better. Is that clipping with it? It is, okay. Let me just sneak you a little bit over. 
Okay. That helps. Aprons! Oh, an apron would be cute. Maybe I don't want this. Unless I can put that apron, like... Is it... How much does it bug you that it clips? Because I don't think it bugs me that it clips. I think it's fine. I kind of want to, I'm thinking about putting this, like having this there. I know the kitchen wall is like really cluttered, but I think that's kind of a good thing. I think that's kind of a positive. I don't want to put any furniture under this because I want to put like a whole gallery wall, but I might just stick like a random art piece so that there's something when I stick it on the gallery and I'll delete that in a second. Because otherwise, I think it's probably pretty much ready for the gallery. Um, and then we can do our custom paintings. Like, we'll do all of our family photos and stuff. But I don't want to put those on the gallery because then it, like, says it has CC when it doesn't, so. Let's find out right now. Does it have CC? Yeah, it thinks it does. Okay. <laughs> Hopefully it's not those paintings. I think it might be this photo. So let's find out. Aha! Okay, Bell Legacy House. This is a four bedroom, four bathroom house. Um, are you going to change that one rug? What rug? Oh, I don't like this one, that's true. I need to, let me think about it. Let me put it in the front for a second. Cause maybe. <laughs> Maybe. What sort of thing would be good instead? Do you think I would like that better? I might even like that better. There's like something about the beige on beige that was really bugging me. I almost like that better. Um, there's no colors on this that I like either. It'll just catch fire anyway. That's fine. We like that. You know what? No. We like the hairy rug. Put the hairy rug back. It's fine. The hairy rug is fine. We like the hairy rug. Let me, you know what, I'm gonna actually go to Manage Worlds um, and put it on the gallery because then it won't be winter. For the gallery photo. Which I think will be better. Um, okay. Oh, I'm so excited. I love how it looks. I'm really proud of this one. And we'll just get yeah, we keep calling it the hairy rug. I'm so sorry. I know it sounds disgusting, but it's because who was it that said that first? Was it little Dika that said it first? Somebody called it a hairy rug once and we were like, oh no, that is a horrible but perfect way to describe it. <laughs> um, and so ever since then. Okay, this is the four bedroom, four bath. I built this for gen seven of my legacy challenge on YouTube, hashtag Lil Simsy. All right, get it up. And there you go, my friends. You may download her as you please. I'm gonna go now back into the house and put my family photos up. Uh, Eclectic and Millie and No Thoughts and Melly and Emmy and Sprout and Rachel and Brie and Mac and Fluffy, thank you for the subs too, okay. Expensive house, yeah. Well, we're on gen seven though, so it makes sense. We've got loads of money at this point, so. <clears throat> I think it's okay. How many packs? Oof, loads, loads of them. So many packs, <laughs> so many packs. <laughs> Is stream gonna end soon? Yeah, probably past, I'm almost done. Um, I'm almost done. Okay, 
Let me get some family photos up. I'm gonna kill this and we're gonna get some lovely gallery walls together. I think I wanna do, are these the large ones? No. I'd like a couple large photos. I would like to have, ideally, on this wall, a photo from every generation. Um, I think that would be super cool if we could do that. Um, obviously, some are better than others, <laughs> but I would like to have, in an ideal world, a photo from each gen. Um, here's a picture of Noah and a puppy. Are these the medium ones? No, those are large. Are these medium? Yeah, okay. We already have you. Maybe we could get... There's Mavis. That We don't have to use that one, but that could be fun. We have to use this one probably, actually. Um... Let me put some frames on these. Okay, so this is Gen 1, Gen 2, Gen 3. Was Cam Gen 4? Amber, Belle, Noah, yeah, Cam. Okay, and then Terry, and then, okay, this is fine. We're good, we're good. Scoot over a little bit. It's gonna be a lovely wall. I'm probably gonna put um, some small photos underneath them. I don't know. We're putting loads of pictures, I'm so sorry. I'm just getting excited, so <laughs> I want like lots of photos. This might not be so interesting to you if you haven't seen the legacy, so for that I apologize, but it's fun for me, so. <laughs> Um, this is the last gen. Dark wood. That's big. I don't think I knew it was gonna be that big. That's okay. Is it too much? Maybe it's too much. It might be too much. Maybe it's okay. I don't know. How should we do it? Well, maybe, what if we just did that many for now? Can you go centered on the wall? What if we just had like this many photos on the gallery wall for now? And then we put some more elsewhere. Instead of trying to fit some tiny ones in here, let's just do it like that on this wall. And then maybe we could put, um, we could probably fit like a little teeny photo. Are these the small ones? No. Are these small? No. These must be small. We can maybe fit a little teeny photo in this. That could be cute. Simsy's voice is going. I know, my voice is going. I've been talking so much trying to do this build, my voice is going. We can put one in there. Rip Gerald. I killed him. Lotus, thank you for the gift and subs. Super and AIDS and Lotus and Eclectic and Millie and No Thoughts and Melly and Emmy and Sprout. Thank you for the subs. Oh, okay. We had some photos on this wall too. Um, maybe we could do, oh yeah, the wedding photo. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. That's Anna and her kids on the wedding day. That's like this gen, but well, this gen's mom, I guess I should say. That's a really good one. Um, this is a photo of these two. Should I, s maybe I'll size it up. Oh, I broke it. That's from when they got engaged. Help. Why is it glitching? 
The game thinks it's like hanging on the on a shelf. Whatever. I don't care. That's Anna and Blake. And this is their bedroom, so I kind of like that too. Um I was going to put a couple in here. These are some medium ones. If we could get some more like that's a sort of recent one. And that's a sort of recent one. That could be cute. It's the same pose. <laughs> These are the last couple generations though, so that might be good. So that that's a nice touch. I like those. Okay. I was thinking about putting a large, are these the large ones? No. Are these the large ones? No. These are the large ones. Let's get an old one. Oh yeah, this is good. This is good. Um, that is the cow plant that killed her dad and that's my raccoon. That's perfect. Okay. That can't think of anything better than that. <laughs> <laughs> that is the perfect photo. Okay. Um, maybe we could get... We could, let's save this wall and we'll hang up some of um, Pepper and Tommy together. We'll get like some more updated romance photos, you know, that'll be good. <clears throat> and maybe on this wall. Mm, I don't like that one. That's boring. I really liked her. That's like an old, old gen, that's gen two. Or, that's Gen 3, I mean. But we could hang up a picture of her and her husband. Have I not put any from Gen 1 up yet? Oh, I haven't put any from Gen 1. Never mind, sorry. I thought I had some on that wall, but I guess I didn't. I took it back down, so. We gotta get some Gen 1 pictures in here. There we go. Lovely. Winter wedding. Perfect. <laughs> Um, let's update that frame. I love the pictures. The pictures make it like so cozy. It's so much fun. Um, I wanted to put some in the hallway too, up here. We could do like a little gallery wall. Let's try and use some more of the small photos. Oh, this one's great. Oh yes, that can be the main photo. And then we can get some like small ones. <laughs> Um, we can get some small ones to go with it. Are these the small ones? Yeah. Perfect. Love it. Absolutely beautiful. Um. That one's nice. That's a large, how, how am I messing this up? I don't think I've used that one yet. That could be funny. Maybe we could put like a couple vertical photos or maybe like one medium vertical photo next to it. That could be good. I might use a different one than that, but. This is a good gallery wall, I think. Um, do we have any like, here's one of a baby. That's cute. Yeah, that's good. I like that. Why is my voice doing this? Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's like totally going. Gross. <laughs> Squizzle. <clears throat> Sorry. <laughs> and Lindsay and Super, thank you for the subs. That is right before that guy died. He did die like right after that, yeah. Oh no, he didn't because Gerald took that photo. Oh, never mind. Gerald was dead. <laughs> So, never mind. Okay, I ended up. Oh, wait, how about this one? Him and his brother doing karaoke. That's cute. I love that one. Yeah, that's good. I like that. Okay. Um, where else? I wonder. Oh, I was gonna put a towel in the bathroom. So that actually would be a good touch. Let's put a towel in here. 
And, oh, I didn't put toilet paper either. Oops. And then we should have enough money for bills, I think, with this. I think um, we did it in a reasonable manner. We didn't spend too much money. Maybe I could put a couple more photos in this bathroom. Because you know what you really need in your bathroom is old family photos. I don't know which ones, <laughs> but what you really need in your bathroom is old pictures. Do I have any in my inventory? Like, do you have any current ones? Okay, that is literally useless. <laughs> That's not even gonna be your wife. That's like somebody else. Whatever, I'll put it there anyway. <laughs> That's at least a picture of her. Um, this is a picture of him and this sim is Tommy. That is gonna be his sister's wife. So we could put a picture of them in here. I sized it up. Um, do you have any? No, I just checked you. You don't have any, you don't have any. Oh, you've got some of the pets. Oh, perfect. Yes, that's what we need. Okay, I'm almost done. I feel like with that, we could probably call it and then we can add to it. You know, I just don't wanna spend too much money um, all at once, but I think this is pretty good. I'm actually really happy with this house. All right, oh, chimney in the chimney. Oops, forgot that too. All right, then that should be the last thing. Just gotta put a chimney in the chimney. Oh, it's all so small. I forgot it's on a diagonal. That kind of messes with the vibes, I won't lie. <laughs> it does kind of mess with the vibes. Okay, um, do we care? Do we like that? I don't know if it's worth it. Check the columns at the entry. Oh, they're in the wrong spot. Oh yeah, good call. And maybe if we got like a little thing in the front. Maybe I'll put a little plant with some sunflowers. There's not a lot of flowers in this house, so that might be a nice, to oh, and it's dead. That's true, I guess we could just size it down because the smoke should still come out, but then we can't see it. I think that should work. We have an outdoor trash can in the back. And my terrain paint is deleted. I'm angry. <laughs> Why does it do this? That is the most annoying glitch in the entire game. <sighs> okay. It's fine, I'll just do it again. Whatever, I'm not upset. I'm glad that I'm doing it again. It's so fun doing the same thing twice, you know? <laughs> Alicia, thanks for the sub, by the way. Um, I really appreciate that. Hey, Luke, thank you for the raid. Welcome in, everybody. We're just finishing up my legacy house right now. You caught us at kind of a good time. Um, I'll give you a tour in a second. Um, my terrain paint just deleted itself, though, so I'm, I'm fixing it. <laughs> One thing at a time, we gotta fix that first. Okay, let me just get a little bit of dirt down there. And then a little bit of dirt down here, a little bit of dirt underneath each of these, a little bit of dirt around this, dirt there, dirt down there. I might actually use like a little bit of the red to put underneath some of this stuff. And then I will save the game and then we should be good to go. It's already on the gallery. I'm just adding a couple things post gallery upload, which makes no sense, but this is because this is what I'm going to be playing with, uh, with my Sims. So I was putting in like all my family photos and stuff, which I didn't want to put on the gallery because then it says it has CC. All right, let's do a tour. 
So when you come up to the house, lighting is terrible. Hang on. When you come up to the house, uh, it looks like this. We tried to go for like kind of a craftsman, but in the desert sort of vibe. Um, and so we've got like a bunch of uh, deserty landscaping. There's fireflies. Um, I'm obsessed with the outside of the house. Um, we have a little like side patio off the grandparents room for them. Um, in the back, we've got a farm section and we have a ton of other things. We've got a bar, we've got a fire pit, giant pool, chickens, um, death pond, you know, all the necessities. <laughs> we also have a greenhouse because my Sim's gonna be a gardener. Um, and then inside the house, it's really big. We have this giant living room with a, a cute like desk in the corner. Um, we've got this kitchen here, love all the decor. We have this little dining table. This little hallway takes you to a bathroom with my fire toilet and also uh, to the grandparents' bedroom. This area over here is the parents' room and their private bathroom. Um, we got a downstairs bath and then upstairs there's two more kids' bedrooms and another bathroom, so. Everyone has been yelling about a chest seal by the pond this, by the pond this whole time. I mean, I guess I can put one, <laughs> but they've been saying it the whole- I've been ignoring it. <laughs> I won't lie. I did not see it. I saw you saying it. I just wasn't- I wasn't reading it out loud. But I can put one out here if you really want one. Our private chess and death pond sanctuary. All right, my voice is fully going. So I'm probably gonna get off stream here in a second, but thank you all so much for helping, with this, helping, me, with, helping me with this today. Oh my goodness. Um, I think that it turned out really well. Um, I really am happy with this build. It's gonna be fun to play in. So if you want to watch me play in it, I have a legacy challenge, like a, a let's play series on my YouTube channel that we've been playing for like seven generations. And this is the house for those Sims. So if you wanna watch it, if you go to my channel, um, you'll see a playlist called like the legacy challenge and um, you can watch it. It's really fun. Um, it's, we're kind of starting a new generation now. So I'll post the video. I think I'll post this speed build on Monday. Um, so like next week on maybe Thursday will be the first episode of like the new generation. So now's a good time to start watching cause it's like kind of a fresh start. Um, so if you want to watch, uh, feel free to stay tuned on my YouTube channel for that this week. Um, and we'll find someone to raid. We're going to do the shell tours on Monday. Uh, I was supposed to do them yesterday, but my internet was out. Oh, I was so annoyed. I was looking forward to it all day. And then my stupid internet went out like 20 minutes before stream. And then it didn't come back until like 6.30. And I was like, at that point, you know. Um, so anyway, I was very upset, but we're going to do them on Monday. I don't usually stream on Sunday, so I won't be here tomorrow. Um, but I think that should keep us caught up. And I'm going to go find someone to raid. Hey, Alicia and Squizzle and Lindsay, thank you for the subs again, by the way. Um, oh, the la the graves are from a different legacy. Um, you might be thinking of my one on Twitch. That's where all the graves are. This is a different family. We only have two graves in this family. Because I keep them in a graveyard. I have a graveyard lot in this family. So, <laughs> we don't have a bunch of graves in the front yard in this one. Um, all right. Let me go find someone to say hello to. You know what? Dr. Gluon is playing The Sims 2? And it looks like he has like 13 hours left of his stream. Oh my goodness. Well, there you go. <laughs> um, I love The Sims 2. That'll be fun. We should go say hi to him. That'll be a fun idea, I think. Um, he's gonna be live all night, apparently. So if you're looking for somebody to watch, Dr. Gluon is the way to go, I guess. <laughs> um, but go say hi to Gluon for me. Have some fun with The Sims 2. That is so exciting. Gluon is a great streamer. If you haven't seen him, you're gonna love, like, the production value of his stream. His alerts are so fun. He's just, he's really fun. You might know him because we did that Sims multiplayer stream together a few weeks ago. Um, he's the one who built that, like, scary baby-shaped house for us to play as toddlers in. Um, so you might recognize him from that. Um, but go say hi to him for me, and I'll catch you all on Monday, okay? You have the weekend to finish your shells. You've got some more time. Um, and I'll see you all later, okay? I love you, I miss you, have the best evening, and I'll see you all tomorrow, okay? Goodbye! <laughs> and stop streaming.